are a schmuck. Yeah, you look like a schmuck. You were born a schmuck. You live your life a schmuck. You are not that a schmuck. What's up, schmucks? Welcome to the show. Mike, how the hell you doing, brother? Oh, I'm doing good, man. How you doing? Doing good, doing good. Uh, drinking some an interesting concoction here. Now, what are you drinking, first of all? I'm drinking my normal uh, Johnny Walker Black. Johnny Walker Black. Good for you. Cheers. Cheers. Dude, I'm drinking uh, a concoction that I... Well, let, me tell you, let me tell you how I came about this concoction. Monica went to the liquor Old store. Semen. Yeah, <laughs> thick, heavy a lot cream. Of <laughs> <laughs> Couple of asshole flakes. <laughs> it's a big. Excuse me, good sir. Would you fart over my glass? It's just, it's just a big cup of semen on ice, and I have some dude fart on it. <laughs> some, some extra heavy cream. <laughs> not, I have to thicken it up with the heavy cream. <laughs> Uga. No. Like Monica, Monica went to the liquor. <laughs> That's salty enough. Don't <laughs> <Like> get <an> horrible. <laughs> yeah. Monica, went, Monica went to the liquor store to get a, a, be- a couple beers. And I, I started said, oh, here you go. And just pick me up a couple of these guys. You know, a couple of my airplane shooters that I like to do now. It's keeps yeah, me yeah. from getting too sloppy. So she picked me up three. Uh, app, just said, yeah, give me some Jim and Apple. I'm feeling like a little flavored whiskey. So give me a little Jim Beam Apple. And she comes home and she the the woman working the counter says, oh, "Are you, are you going to get this? Do you ever you know do you put it in a uh, Angry Orchard the the cider?" Looks like no, I don't drink yeah. this. And I was like, "Oh man, that that sounds good." So yeah. I'm drinking one full one of these in a glass on uh, of Angry with, Orchard with Angry Orchard on top of it. Your farts are going to be. Horrendous. Tonight. They're going to be sour oh, as fuck, app, dude. App, They're app, gonna be apple so bitter. Farts. So bitter. Yeah, They're going to burn yeah. your eyes. It's going to burn eyes. It's like fart and pure vinegar. <laughs> you're going to wake up. Yeah, you'll be in a dead sleep. You're going to fart and not even know. Wake up. I'm going to wake up. I'm going to wake up. Like, I'm, try- I'm going to wake up like, how come I can't blink? My fucking eyelids are going to melt off like mustard gas you're out of my ass. Monica's, Mo- Monica's face is all charred and burned, just steam coming off it. She looks like Deadpool. She wakes like up, a- she looks like fucking Deadpool. <laughs> <Good smoke coming laughs> the fuck face. did you do to me? No, she's dead. She's long been long dead. <laughs> <laughs> like beef jerky. She's just a carcass. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's it. It's mummified. It's straight up mummified. Like Kids out come in. What'd you do to mom? Just drop on the ground. <laughs> you see like an apple or like an apple crustacean come over. <laughs> Perfectly preserved. Looks like an apple pie crust. Mm-hmm. <laughs> it's almost like a it's like a um the shit was the, the, the mosquito stuck in in um oh yeah the uh the um sap not yeah, sap the amber the sap, amber yeah <laughs> apple amber <laughs> <laughs> perfectly mummified. DNA is perfectly intact. I'm going to love you guys forever. <laughs> yeah, <I want. laughs> yeah. And then, so I go back to the liquor store. Um, then we're back to the liquor store. Now, here, here's the joys of being a, a girl dad and having two girls. So I went back to the liquor store, and you may have noticed my nails are painted. Oh, no. Oh, no. Yeah. 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 So Jenna. <laughs> Yeah. So Jenna went went to the store yesterday and she got this nail buffer thing that she wanted from Five Below. It's like a little it's like a Dremel, but for your nails. And yeah, she make got them really thing. buff out and shine. And it's sharp. She sharpens right to a point, like a file. She's yeah. gonna be like slicing people. But she's like she's ex- <laughs> she <laughs> don't piss her up. Wolverine. It's a Wolverine daughter. Yeah. Dude, but she uh, so she bought this thing and she's excited to use it. <clears throat> and she did her nails <clears throat> all nice and nice, and she was real pumped up. So her sister wouldn't let her do her nails because she's a bitch. And Monica was busy, so she's like, "Dad, dude, she's like, Wait, hold, up, hold up, hold up, come here, come here, yeah. here. Wait, you gonna say hi? Wait, come here. You can say good night. You going to bed? Mm-hmm. Oh, here, wait. There you go. What's up, dude? Nice pajamas. Say hi. Thanks. Yeah, those are sweet. Spider Man is the best. What are you saying? 
Tell them what you did last night. Uh, Went to the baseball game. Yeah. What were you crying about? You were super hot, right? Yeah, I was super hot and when it, we were going to the baseball game. And what, what did everybody tell you? It's going to be freezing cold, right? Mm-hmm. Dude, you just shit on my leg. <laughs> Attaboy. Attaboy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, dude, He's let so us go. <laughs> Gross. Get out of here. Go check that up and give it to mommy. No, no, no. Keep going. Keep I, I'm gonna, you know what? I ate a lot of Brussels sprouts tonight. I'm going to go in his room while he's sleeping. Yeah, you better watch out, though. You better watch out. Payback's you a look mother. Look up and you see dad's butt right here. <laughs> 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 Get lost wakey, in the hair. Wakey, party. <laughs> <laughs> it looks like tentacles. It's gonna look like one of the fucking tentacle monsters. Or something. Oh shit! Oh, he's dark in hair. <laughs> <laughs> oh shit! That's good. That's All right, good. Man. Say good night. Tell her good night. What? Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night, bud. All right, give me a hug. Good night. Oh, I love you, buddy. I'll see you in the morning, okay? You stinky turd. <laughs> You get out of here. Yeah. You left a brown. You're leaving a brown mark out here. Get down so you don't hit that cord. Look, there already is a brown mark. Right? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> brown mark in your underwear. I'll see you later, buddy. I love you. Ah, right, kids. Yeah. yeah. yeah we took him last night. Took him to the game last night. It was a senator's game. Oh, wait. Go back to yours now. I'll All right. You now. So, so, uh, so she got it. She polished her nails. She did her nails real nice. Her sister wouldn't let her do her nails because she's a bitch. And Monica was busy, yeah. so she comes to me. Dad, can I do your nails? So I'm like, yeah, all right. God, you're real excited. She did a whole polishing thing and then did them all nice. And this was the only color she had available. So that's what I got. But I forget that it's on my nails because you don't feel nail polish. You just, yeah, so I'm, out, I'm doing all my thing. I, I went I went to this back to this Gans Media place today to get more video games because the place is awesome. And I paid. He didn't notice that. He didn't say anything. Nothing happened. And I went. Oh, he noticed. Home. He noticed it. He probably you're blind with the buff on there. You're blinding. It's just <laughs> the that. Well, good thing I, I was with Leah too, so it, it looked all right. But then uh, I get home and Jenna's like, "Oh, did the guy say anything about your nails?" I'm like, "Nah, Jenna, he didn't say anything." She's like, oh, "What the fuck?" Like, nah. Yeah, actually, he did. Actually, did he said, "Hey." Yeah, after I left. <laughs> after I left, I'm sure he had a lot to yeah. say. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Fucking dude. But she's like, "Oh, fucking what the fuck?" She's like upset. Like, why didn't he say anything about your nails? Yeah. yeah. So I go to the liquor store back to get the Angry Orchard because now I hear about this Angry Orchard drink. I'm like, oh, I'm going to try this shit tonight. So I go back to the liquor store and I pay again, totally forgetting that I have this fucking stupid paint on my nails, which I have to take off tomorrow before I go back to work on fucking Tuesday. No, so, you should just keep it. So I pay and the woman goes, she says, oh, nice, nice. She says nice nails, I think. Nice nails. I, I like that color on you. And I was like, I looked down at my shirt. And I'm like, I'm like, oh, thanks. Come. I'm like, oh, let's say it's just a fucking red sweatshirt. It's not great about it. I'm like, yeah, yeah. I'm like, oh, thanks. And I like grab my sweatshirt, and then I see the nail, the the painting on my nails. I'm like, oh, oh, hey, shit. You know what? I got Thank two daughters. You. I got two daughters. I said, I said, That's right. Hey, I said my daughter's gonna be very happy that you you mentioned my nails. She's gonna be. I had to throw. I'm like, my daughter did this. She did my nails last night, and she's gonna be very happy that you that you noticed. The nails. I said, I got two I'm not gay. I got two I said, daughters. And a wife. Sex, sex okay. with a woman. Two daughters, two daughters. This is what happens. You got fucking nails and <laughs> yeah. you forget about it. And then you walk out in the public and you got fucking <laughs> nail polish on your hands. It's happened to me she multiple laughing. times. Yeah, she oh, was yeah. laughing. Oh, sure. I'm like, <sighs> but yeah, that's what it is. That's what it, it takes a real man yeah, let me try to raise women because this is the shit that you have to deal with. Yeah. This, no, and no, I, I, look, I'm not going to lie. I got I'm, some new blush. Let me I've, try the blush. I've, I have been there with my daughters first, both of them. When they first started doing makeup and working on makeup, I've had my makeup done many times. Come home to my Monica has come home to me, blushed up, rouged, and again, I forget. <laughs> I I will forget that it's on. I've I have gone to bed and woken up the next morning, and then I'm brushing my teeth in the morning. I'm like, oh yeah, oh shit, they did my makeup. Good thing I looked in the mirror before I went to work. <laughs> down, boy, down. That's false. Settle down, man. False advertising. <laughs> I'm like, hey, maybe I don't need a wife. <laughs> Just say. I know it's our blow. It is our blow myself kisses in the mirror. It's working for me, yeah. baby. It's, yeah. all, it's, all, it's been a long quarantine. Uh, <laughs> you'd be like, you'd be doing that shit like uh, uh what's that? That Shane Gillis on the uh, on fans only, only fans. Yeah, yeah. Only. <laughs> yeah. Um. Yeah, dude. Did she laugh when you told her though? She had me laughing, right? Who the woman? Yeah, yeah, she got it. She understood. Yeah, we 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 went last night to the game, and uh, 
And uh, Nico's like, you know, little motherfucker, right? I got these tickets from work. My boss bought them. It was opening night. He, two of the guys, uh, the one dude black packed out already. I'm like, the fuck, I gotta go. So uh, it was me, um, uh, Glenn Tech, and, and Nico. But Nico's like, I don't want to go. But my, she put double sweatpants on. I swear <laughs> she, I'm freaking sweating. It's gonna be hot. It's hot outside. I'm like, buddy, it's not hot outside. I've been outside all day. I said, we're gonna be down by the river. The the senator stadium is right in the middle of the river on an island, right? Yeah. What do you? And no. uh, we get, dude. He was bitching the whole way there, the whole ride. Right? <laughs> you got the you're driving to the car, got the heat all the way up, cooking, baking them out. It's making us heat all the way up. It's fine. You'll be fine. I put the yeah. heat on. Uh, we get the we windows get there, up, like heat on. I, Sweating him out in yeah, the fucking yeah. car. Fucking motherfucker. <laughs> you can see Pete just sweat. But he, <laughs> he he gets there. We we walk over. I'm like, hey, you want to put your shorts on now? You want to take that? Sh- yeah, let's take that jacket off. No, no, I'll keep it. I'll keep it. I'm like, yeah, it's cold, right? By the end, like, he's fucking frozen, dude. He's like, I can't feel my toes. I'm like, yeah. yeah. I told you it's going to be cold. Should I listen? Like you, we were talking before. Yeah, kids don't understand. I, I did it. I, I My daughter's just last Easter. They're stupid. They, yeah. they, they, they were going to my my brothers and it's beautiful it was nice during the day 60 degrees you know 55 60 degrees nice you could be outside in a t-shirt and shit but i said we're gonna be there after dark we're gonna be there after sunset it's going to get cold after sunset it gets chilly this time of year after sunset once that sun goes in you know what you're talking uh, about and monica's like arguing with them she's you got we're we're not leaving it i said man fuck them don't bring a sweatshirt i said no don't fine but when you're standing out there i'm not giving you my sweatshirt just know that so yeah. what happens? We sunsets and we're all sitting there. I've got my sweatshirt on. Everyone's putting their coats on. I'm nice and toasty. And here goes my, you know, my smart ass daughter. Oh shit! I'm cold. I'm cold. Give me your sweatshirt. I'm cold. Mm-mm. Giving you shit. Go stand by the fire. Cold. See if you can get close enough to that fire without burning yourself. Stay warm like that. Yeah, you know, I'm sorry, honey. I'm sweating under here. If I take this off, I'm gonna be, oh, be cold. Yeah, yeah, that that wind's gonna. My yeah. stupid mother gives her a fucking sweatshirt though. Yeah, it's so, not totally defeated. Doing? Yeah, it destroyed me. Just, yeah, yeah, yeah it's totally. She ain't gonna die. No. She ain't gonna die. Guess what? Oh, shit. Yeah. She ain't gonna die. And if she's really that cold, she can go inside and just watch everyone from the window. Lessons to be learned here. This is less life lessons. We've been around. We know shit that you might not think we do, but we do. No, no. Yeah, dude, I haven't been on this planet for 46 years, right? Yeah. Almost 47 years. Yeah, so, I know. Yeah, we, I might have picked might, up might have learned yeah, a little just, bit. Just a little, little bit. bit. Yeah, shit. You just went through two, two, uh, you just went through a tra- traumatic uh, experience yesterday, right? Did. Well, we'll get into that. We'll get into that. But, yeah. uh, uh t- so, wait, oh, any, any, wait, any, and so that's, that was it for, for my, my weekend so far with my girls. So I oh, just paint nails and it's good. I'm drinking, glad you went out there. What? I'm glad you went out with the nail polish. I've got it. I'm, I can guarantee you, Mike, if I don't take it off tomorrow, I, I'm going to go to the doctor on Monday and then back to work on Tuesday with this nail polish on my hands. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. It'll be normal. Yeah. You just do it. Go around. That's all right. Put a little yeah. glitter on your eyes. You know? <laughs> little glitter, right. little, little lipstick on. <laughs> yeah, yeah. The real glossy shit. Did you it ever started, see that freak that, that works started off with eye? nail polish and it just kept looking so much better. Nail polish, I look so much better. <laughs> look how pretty. You ever see that freak <laughs> that was working for the uh, for the Biden administration? He was like in in charge of uh, getting rid of nuclear waste, and he uh, he was stealing women's clothes at the airport. Dude, we got I got it. Order. I got to show. I got to show you this picture. You got to see this freak. He always wears bright red lipstick. Right, completely normal. Let's put him in charge of something. You know, yeah, something that's uh, as... yeah, yeah, something in the country, something important in the country. Yeah, that's, that's a great idea. Great idea. I see. Dude in charge of nuclear waste. I got to show you this. The, it, it, nuclear. Nuclear. Nuclear waste. Wet. Nuclear made. What's that? Oh, motherfucker. Is this it? Gotta break the tension a little bit. Yeah, this is it. All right, I've had it. I've had it. I'm sending you a picture. Hold on, let me find a good, disgusting one. Waiting for my thing. Hold on. All right, hold on. Oh, my God. Oh, my 
Hold on, I'll send it to you. Oh, still not, not found oh. it. Oh, you just said you found it. Well, I found, I found it, I found it, I found it. Hold on. Oh, I just got it. Hang I'll on, right. I just got it. Hang on. Uh, 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 yeah, hold on, look at it and let me come right back. Wait, don't look at it yet. Don't look at it. Wait till I get back. All right. Too quiet. Just wait because it's disgusting. All right. This is going to be you in a couple, couple more. <laughs> Yeah, <laughs> disgusting. Kind of bald head there. <laughs> how disgusting is that freak? God, how can you? How could anybody? Like, how could any other nation in this world take our country seriously anymore? Like, that's yes, this is dude. this is somebody in the presidential cabinet. Our president is a senile old fucking man. Is is it? We're a, we're a joke. Ugh. We are an absolute fucking joke. Disg- that, looks like, that looks like Uncle this- Fester with fucking lipstick on. Yeah, dude, there's even worse pictures. If I, I was just, I just grabbed one real fast. But what I makes mean, you, what complete, makes you, when, when, when they come in freak. for an interview, what makes complete. you say, yeah, this, this person we want, we want this guy working oh, for us? I'll tell you what it is because they, they're sitting there and trying to, oh, yeah, we're all for it. We're all for it. Blah, blah. No, that, that's a mentally disturbed motherfucker that you're giving some serious responsibility to. Yeah, way too and, serious. And then they can't, and then they, well, even better than that, they caught this motherfucker stealing women's mm-hmm. luggage at a airport when it mm-hmm. spins around on the thing. He's stealing Maybe it. soon, dude. Starts with What's... nail polish. Next thing you know, I'm stealing <laughs> women's luggage at the bit. airport. Man, next week, I think I this see would it. look great on me. <laughs> <laughs> Sitting there in Monica's dress. It's all buff. It's all like real tight around the arms and shit. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. Which is gross. You hire you hire girls to do the show now. They they get you all set up and bait up before you come on. Mm-hmm. I look like a yeah, I look like a complete <laughs> it's your makeup girl. Look. Yeah, I got hair again. Locks <laughs> looks natural, doesn't it? You come only my hairdresser. Hair only my hairdresser knows for sure. You, might, you remember the <laughs> you remember the uh, what was that old movie? The the old TV show uh, with her, Little House on the Prairie. Remember yeah. the blonde with the weird hair? Yeah, the, the curls. The, the swell brat girl. Yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> <Doesn't> look. <laughs> Only my hairdresser knows for sure. <laughs> it's disgusting. Meanwhile, you can see where it's cut down and shit. See my stubble growing in underneath yeah, it. Yeah, my, yeah. Si- my sideburns are coming out. <laughs> totally different color. <laughs> Eight o'clock shadow. <laughs> This is fucking gross. Oh, shit. <laughs> yep, that is definitely my future. I'm pretty. <laughs> <laughs> I'm a pretty girl. I'm a pretty girl. <laughs> pretty birdie. Pretty birdie. <laughs> oh, fuck. Oh, shit. <laughs> my head's hurting. I, know, I, had, I had a video. I, was just, I just watched it because I was waiting for you to get on. But there's a dude, and it's I guess it's morons at the at the fucking shooting range. But this guy has a revolver. He shoots it, right? <laughs> One shot. So that means there's five more shots in there. The guy goes, we <laughs> it spins around. <laughs> like, what the fuck, dude? Like, I mean Wait, is he... oh shit, my back's itching. Just... Wait. Does he shoot himself again? Does he pull the trigger again? No, like, off? dude, he would have been. It would have been lights out. It would have been that was it. <laughs> and so, oh, so I that's do a gun. Talk. That is a gun telling you, don't ever fucking shoot yeah, me again. You, you don't do ever. You're done. Uh, stick you the know. pocket knives. <laughs> so, so this, I got a story for you. Okay, and I think I told you already, but so like 20 years ago, I used to work for a carpentry company up uh, down in South Jersey, and I worked with these two two brothers, and. uh they were they were cool guys. They were cool guys when I worked there. They, we called them the Marble Brothers, right? And the reason was because when they talk, they sound like balls in their mouth, right? Mm. Yeah, that was definitely Bueller. <laughs> no, it wasn't. It Bueller. was just. That no, was just mute, mute, <laughs> mute. Yeah, that was beeper, beeper, beeper from the Muppets. Beep, beep, beep. <laughs> uh, but uh, <laughs> so anyway. When I first started this company, my, my one buddy, Kev, I'm still friends with him to this, to this day. He's cool as fuck. But I called him up just out of nowhere, just talked to him. But uh, when I first started working at this company, I didn't know Kev. I didn't know anybody, right? And me and Kev were driving together. He goes, yo, you want to see something funny? I'm like, yeah, whatever. Yeah, let's see something funny. So we had those old Nextel cell phones, like the walkie-talkie. He goes, watch this. Picks up. He goes, yo, Vinny, what are you guys at? What are you doing? 
puts it down. He has a big smile on his face, right? I don't know what's happening, right? <laughs> like that, right? I started dying. He <laughs> started dying. We were dying. He goes, yeah. He goes, they're, they're the Marvel brothers, right? He goes, you know, okay, if you get Anthony or Vinny, they both sound like they have fucking nuts in their mouth. But anyway, <laughs> the guys are cool. They were nice, you know, nice dudes. They're a little fucking crazy. They're pineys. You know, pineys from the Pine Barrens. That means yeah. they're the, the New Jersey Hicks, right? And, uh, but anyway, fast forward. I just called my buddy the, the, the other day just to check up on him, see how he's doing. That same and, guy uh, you were talking about? The same guy, James? Uh, 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 Kevin, or Kevin, 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 yeah, whatever his name is. Yeah. yeah. He goes, Yo, you remember uh, Vinny? And I'm like, Yeah, I remember Vinny. It's been 20 years or so since I've talked to Vinny, but I remember those two motherfuckers. But he's like, Yeah, man, he went fucking nuts the other night. He, uh, he, uh, um, I guess his wife or something called in a domestic. And, uh, man, he came out fucking blazing with guns, shot a cop, didn't kill a guy, but he shot him. And then they unloaded on him, man. He's fucking done. But yeah, the guy went fucking nuts. Lost his cool. Everybody That's thinks crazy. I'm the fucker. I'm the mental one. No, you are the mental one. You just keep, you just <laughs> I, keep I, I, it in a psychotic comedy. Fight it back. It's, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's, it's a little bit of psychoticness to it. That keeps psychotic me calm. calmness. Like, uh, no, you're not going to go off the wall and have the cops c- kill you. No, no, no. No, no. That's yeah. not your style. That's not your style. <laughs> you're quiet down. You're quiet down and calmly threaten them that you're going to punch them in. I'm gonna, Put those guns down. Get them out of my face. I'm gonna punch you in the fucking teeth. Punch <laughs> in the fucking teeth. Punch, so, punch in your teeth. I'm gonna punch in the fucking throat. I'm punch in the fucking throat. I'm gonna put them fucking guns out of my face. I'm gonna punch you in the fucking throat. <laughs> Dude, a couple it was about a month or two ago. I'm in a company truck and I pull up at this this station, the gas station, right to to fill up. And this, uh, you know, I got to pull in. It's a big fucking long truck. I got to pull in and back up and go. And I got my body hazard lights on and shit. And this one asshole pulls out, like, tries to go around me. It's narrow. There's cars all over the fucking place. I can only go where I can go. And I back in and he pulls up him and his girl. And they start, he gets out of the car. He's like, Ooh. doing this shit to me, right? Doing like the, the suck a dick sign. <laughs> right. And I sit there and I'm like, man, eh, fuck this today. I get out of the truck, right? I said, oh, fuck. Right? I go up. I said, I said, I'll fuck you up. And I said, I'll fuck your girl right in front of you, motherfucker. Right, right in the middle parking lot with all my company shit on, right? The company truck, right? I'm going off. Right? I said, get out of the fucking car. I said, get, come over here. Come over here. I said, I'm going to break you up. I'm going to fucking break you up. I'm going to break your fucking arm. I said, she's going to be wiping your fucking ass for the next couple months. I said, come here. Come on, tough guy. Like, dude, mental. Wait, why why was he giving you the finger and all that shit? He was because he was a fucking retard. Just because he was a retard. Tr- he didn't cause have because you were back in I'm your in truck. There and I blocked a way that he the one way he has five other ways to go, but the one way that he decided to go as I'm back in my truck in, right? Inconvenienced him a little bit. Oh no, oh, he ran around me like a moron. And then he there was another truck over there doing something. So he got stuck by that truck. He <laughs> come back, and then he tried to get tough with me, right? But I was in no mood. I was going to, dude, I would have been in jail that day. If he would have came, got out of his car and came over, I would have made him drink fucking diesel fuel, held him down, put the fucking thing in his mouth and pumped him up. <laughs> I was make him swallow a match. Then make him swallow a match. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. That's so fuck. <laughs> put him back in the car with his girl and light him on fire. <laughs> Take that, son of a bitch. <laughs> he deserved every minute of it. <laughs> yeah, because I see the fire shooting out of his mouth, a human torch. It's, it's got to be you. Got, you're like a magnet for it because it doesn't. I don't. I don't get that. I don't get that. And I, I'm on the road yelling at people, trying to yell at people on the road. The idiots on the road that that piss me off, and I'm yelling at them, and and they won't look at you. I didn't. I'm not. Yeah. If I don't look, if I don't look, he's not there. You know, I'm. Like, <laughs> if I don't look at him, yeah, he's it. not really there. <laughs> and then, you know that's the other thing. Too. All you got to do, like. Seriously, was like if you fuck up and and cut somebody off, just put your hand up, and say sorry, For acknowledge real. the fuck up, acknowledge, acknowledge, that you acknowledge up. it, yeah, it, because it takes that rage and it, it yeah. just subsides because you've been, like, oh, okay, okay, no, it's cool, yeah, you're good, it's yeah. cool, dude, no yeah. problem, yeah, yeah, no problem, ah, punch the fucking seat, just let that rage out a little bit, like, yeah. But then it's the assholes who, when they don't acknowledge it and don't give you the, hey, my bad wave, it's like, then you're clearly doing it on purpose and you don't give a fuck that you just fucked yeah. everything up, you piece of shit. Well, hey, hey, um, 
not yesterday morning, the day before, I almost, I wouldn't be here. I was driving. We had, it was like you know, the, it was real foggy out, right? Over here. And I'm going to work in the morning. It's, you know, I leave it like around six and I'm going in the morning. It was dark as fuck and foggy. And I get on the main road. It's two lanes and people are whipping, right? So I'm driving and I'm doing about 50 miles an hour. It's probably like 40 mile an hour spot, but it was, it was real foggy. I don't want to hit a deer or nothing, but there's two lights coming down towards me. And all of a sudden I see the light behind these come around and it took my eyes a minute to adjust this motherfucker, dude, if he would, if we would have connected, it would have been a head on. He was doing about 65, 70 miles an hour. Was he passing the guy on the other side? Passing two cars in the fog around the bed, like a fucking idiot. I missed them by inches. If we would have connected, I probably wouldn't be here today. And as I just fucking got over as far as I could and just missed them, if there, um, thank God there wasn't a spot for me to turn around. That's all I could say. Thank God mm-hmm. there wasn't a spot for me to turn around because the full rage went. I like I, I was gonna, dude. If I would have got this motherfucker over, I'd be in jail. He got. He would have killed me. He would have killed me. Would have killed uh, anybody that was coming around if I didn't react when I did. We, you were in. I you were in your truck, right? In my personal truck going yeah. to work in the morning. And this fucking asshole, what he did was like, he needed a beating. I, I wish I didn't even get to see what kind of car it was because it was so foggy. But man, did I want to fucking kill. Uh, yeah. It was raging. Well, since we're like, talking about stupidity. Yeah. I'll just talk about because it was another thing on my list to talk about tonight. And then I'm glad my girls are with me because they're st- I think, I hope, and I think that they are starting to realize I'm right. That people are stupid mm-hmm. and like, when I drive and someone does something stupid and it aggravates the ever loving shit out of me and they're like, why? And I want them dead. And I'm like, Oh, I want them dead. I want them to die right now. Like I want to watch them die. That would make me much pleasure to watch this person die in a bad way. But they're like, why, why does it bother you? Why? Yeah. I'm like, and I'm like stupid stupidity and stupid people around the world affect my life. That's they do affect my life. They do. When I have to stand in line for 40 hours because some fucking moron is asking a bunch of dumb questions at a fucking, at a store. Or just being an idiot at a fucking store. Yeah, that affects me. I got to get stuck behind a moron on a fucking highway. That's going to take me now an extra 45 mm. minutes to get home. That affects me. Okay, this yeah. is this is how stupidity affects you. So Saturday, no, Friday, yesterday. Uh, I want to take the dog to doggy daycare. It's a little place over, over in Rockaway. You just drop the dog yeah. off. He runs around with a bunch of other dogs for a couple hours. He loves it. He, yeah. does, he loves it. Gets kennel cough. Yeah, all kinds of good shit, you know. <laughs> yeah, uh, yeah, yeah. But no, but yeah. he loves it, and and it's a good place. Yeah. They they you know they screen the dogs and everything. Like you have to temperament test them before you even bring them there. You have to bring them. They test them to make sure mm-hmm. he's he's not aggressive and you're not got any issues. So the dogs are all good. The pups, yeah. yeah, exactly. So yesterday, I'm like, you know, well, we're going out. I'm going out to the store with the girls. And I'm like, eh, let me take the dog. To hey, the real fucking... real quick, what's your dog's name again? Rusty. Rusty, I got to remember that because the Reg is the one I remember. You know. Yeah, Reg. Yeah, yeah. So I'm, I'm taking the girls to, to Five Low. They want to do some shopping for Jenna wants to get her fucking nail thing and everything. So yeah. I'm, I'm, I'm like, let me take the dog over to the fucking dog at daycare. It's been a shitty, rainy week. He hasn't done anything all fucking week. Let me let him go play for a little while. So I call him because I'm like, I don't know what time they're open to. I call him. It's two. It's like two o'clock. Right, right around two o'clock. Maybe a little after two. I call him. Hey, uh, you guys, what time are you guys? Oh, you guys doing doggy daycare today? What time are you guys open to? We're, we're open. We have doggy daycare till six today. Oh great! I'll be okay. Two at two o'clock. Yeah, four hours. Great. I'm only gonna be like maybe two, yeah. maybe an hour or two at the store. No problem. Yeah, so I yeah. get him all pumped up. Come on, Reg or Rusty, you want to go? You want to go doggy daycare? Come on, bud. Let's go. We go get him in a car. He, he sees where we're at and he instantly knows where we are. He's fucking pumped up, charging into the place like running like hell, like all pumped up to go in there. Yeah, 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 yeah. Right? And I go in and I open the door to put him in the kid the, the running area. And he's waiting there, wait, like like you can tell he's fucking pumped shaking. up, shaking, yeah, yeah, like yeah, wiggling, yeah. And shaking, like ready to go in there. And the girl's like, are you here for doggy daycare? I'm like, yeah. She's like, oh, we don't take dogs after 2 o'clock. It's 2.15. I'm like, no shit. Okay. And now I'm like, come on, bud. And I'm trying to pull him out because he don't want to go. I'm like, let's go, bud. Yeah. And I, pull, I finally get him out. And I'm like, what the fuck? I didn't know that. And then the girls go, why? Eh, I don't know. We had new management. I don't know why. You're up until 6. Why can't you take a dog after 2? I would say maybe yeah. 4 yeah. o'clock, but 2? Come on. But uh, I would have just told her, I'll, I'll pay like I was here at 2 o'clock. Okay, it's not gonna it, make a difference. I'm coming back any, in an hour just to let him burn off some juice. It doesn't cost anything. It doesn't and, yeah. and it's I have to pick him up still by six. I, I don't know what the reasoning is, but anyway. And as I'm walking out, I didn't think anything of it. But then my Leah actually said she goes, Why didn't they tell you that when when you called? 
Yeah. And that and and then then and because now now it clicked and I didn't even realize the stupidity of it. is like daughter this. Daughter like She goes. She goes like this. She goes. John, watch this. I'm gonna get a little pissed. Watch, watch. Probably. Dad, dad, dad. Why didn't they? Why didn't they tell you that? It? <laughs> oh, and it was. It was. It was. Because it was. It was. It was. It was instantly that. She's like, why didn't they just tell you that when you called? And I'm like, yeah, yeah. What? Did, what? did you walk back in? I no, no, I didn't. I was in a car. I was like. Why the fuck didn't they tell me? I called. It was 2 o'clock. And I said, what time do you have doggy daycare till? Six. But we don't take any dogs after two. Would have saved me the fucking ride there. Get the dog all pumped up. And then I just had I took him to my mother's just so he could run around my mother's dog for a little while so he could burn off some energy because he was all fucking pumped up. But I'm like, are yeah. you kidding me? And then I'm now, I'm now I'm off. See, girls, do you see? This is how stupidity affects my life. Because I wouldn't even have driven here if the dumb bitch on the phone just said, we don't take dogs after two, so don't waste your fucking time coming here. But she didn't because she didn't have enough fucking sense to mention that little tidbit to me. They actually uh, see, they actually could see like your heart going like this. <laughs> it's like fucking, popping out. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Uh, <laughs> like aliens. Explodes. Aliens. And then my, my mother's like, well, you know, they have a sign on the door that says no dogs after two. I said, that's great. I still would have had to drive there to see that fucking sign when the bitch could have just told me on the phone. We don't take dogs after two. Done. Done. Yeah. Problem solved. Yeah. <sighs> I can't Especially stand Especially if you're there all the time. You know, that's like, I would have just been like, hey, right, listen, we, uh, I, I'll pay like I was here too. If you just let him in. It's there's just no, the burn it some it's energy no pain. It's no pain. I don't know why they don't take, it doesn't cost you any more money. They're there till Wait. six. It should, you got to pick your dog up by six. All right. So if I yeah. drop him off by two, I'll be here by six. Like I don't live yeah. hours away. This is all new man. Like it's it's a new new management because I used to be able to bring them there on Saturdays. I used to bring them there Saturday mornings a couple times a month and let them run around in the morning on Saturdays because we're at work all day Friday and they're they're closed at six. So by the time we get home, it's pointless and you can't bring them there after two anyway. So, but now I can't bring them there at all unless I'm home uh, during the week. So, whatever. It, it's fucking stupid. It's stupid. New management and just assholes, just being assholes. Daughters. Yep. Okay, Mike, I'm going to get you pissed. And I hate to do it, but so, you know, a couple of weeks ago, I don't even know if I released the episode. I know where you're going. I, I know where I you're going. I think I, I know did. Where you're going. I think I did release the episode anyway. Okay. Uh, well, it doesn't matter. We can talk about it. By the time they get this, that's going to be released. Yeah, yeah, uh, yeah. In, right. in, in, right. in an episode a couple weeks ago. Are you talking? Are you are you talking about? Are you going in the comics? Yeah, because I mentioned okay. in the right, show, right, and, I, and I'm pissed because I mentioned, and I look like an asshole because I read an article on this fucking show that yeah. Marvel had come to their senses, and we're not going to continue with their gender swapping bullshit, and we're going to keep the Silver Surfer in the upcoming. Fantastic Four movie as a man. It was going to be Norn Rad. It was going to be the Silver Surfer. Yep. But I wake up, I think Friday morning or Thursday morning. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Hold it. Wait, wait, rewind. Rewind. What was his name? Norn Rad was the was Silver Surfer. Is that his real name in Silver Surfer? Yeah. His, his Silver Surfer's real name is Norn Rad. Norn Rad, Norn Rad, something like that. Rad, Rad, right? Like the yeah. sur- he's a surfer, so he's Rad. Totally Rad. Okay. Okay, so <laughs> Rad, dude. and so I read this article. They're not going to cast Anna Tyler Joy. They're going to keep him as a male and blah, blah, blah. And I'm like, yes, okay, Marvel. There's still hope for Marvel. They're coming to their senses. They're not going to. They're, they're listening to fans distaste for their movies, and they're making the right choices now. But I wake up. I think it was like Thursday or Friday morning. And uh, what, what's a big article in my Google feed? Casting complete for Silver Surf for an upcoming Fantastic Four movie. Marvel casts Julia Garner. To play Shala Ball, the fucking lover of the Silver Surfer. So there you have it, Marvel. You have lost yet another fan. I'm done with you. Wait, she's you... the lover. Wait, wait, wait. She's the lover of the Silver Surfer. Yeah, she's the Silver Surfer's lover. So you know when he talks about how Galactus is gonna like kill his woman in in the the original. Thing Maybe she's Marvel? just a woman. Maybe she's no, just she's the a villain. Woman. She is the villain and the Silver Surfer in the new movie. <sighs> yeah. So they have they have yeah. done it again. Marvel has trashed. I'm done. I'm every, done. I'm they done. have destroyed yet another movie done. and taken. All right, I'm gonna. I'll, I'll give you this. The girl, I guess Shala Ball or whatever the fuck her name is, she's a character in Marvel, and I guess at some point she is a Silver Surfer, but it's probably so small and un that nobody really knows. But everyone knows fucking. No, nobody knows. Nobody knows. Nobody knows. Fucking Silver Surfer as the man. I was so 
I like comics. I don't know about her being a right, silver. Exactly. The Silver Surfer is the Silver Surfer. The Silver, yeah, right, right. It, it's some yeah. new if age gonna, comic that they make that the fucking comic. Room. Yeah, if you're gonna do the comic of the Silver Surfer, which, by the way, everybody wants to see, right, and will see, you keep the Silver Surfer as he is because nobody's done that story good yet. They haven't done it justice. Nope. Now you're trying to change that, and you're turning into a fucking it, it's it's girl power with Disney and fucking fag power. I, I'm done with them. I'm done. Tell I'm done. That. that was that was last straw. Cancel your subscription. I'm thinking to about Disney. it because do I don't think it. my no, kids should. watch. I don't think my kids watch anything on Disney anymore. Yeah, get rid of them. Get rid of them, dude. They're fucking so, garbage. They're destroying everything. They're, Marvel they're needs to back out of that. They really do. Shit. They need to get the fuck away get from the Disney fuck because out. they're destroying. I'm I'm done. I won't go see this fucking this trash. See, movie. I think this is what I think, dude. I think that uh, this whole woke movement bullshit. Right, which they're all part of. They're really trying to destroy the fabric of what America is. And believe it or not, like comics, uh, big companies like Budweiser, the shit that they did, it's done intentionally. It can't be that fucking dumb. These people, I'm, I'm hoping they can't be that stupid. What, Mike, are you really? That. Are you, I'm you hoping. Really don't, I, you see wait, the world. You I'm see the way the world is. People are that fucking wait, wait, stupid. Wait, wait, wait. Hold on, look, hear me, hear me out, hear me out. Though I'm hoping that in my in the back of my head. I'm thinking, like, please just be some very intelligent Nazis that are trying to destroy <laughs> America from the inside. Like, this is, like, it. Captain America and the fucking... Yeah, well, yeah, yeah, and, like, uh, what's what's the bad guys? What's the bad Hydra. guys in Captain Hydra. America? Hydra. It could Hydra. Be. Let, let it be some, like, Hydra shit, please. Like, they're, they're trying to destroy, like, uh, you know, main yeah, state. Main, main, it, whatever, it could like, be all uh, the Russian sleeper cells that they put in here in the 80s. And now they, they yeah, finally yeah, got and, in high enough power and now they're destroying no, American society. If they start trying, oh, listen, that new thing too with uh, them going after Trump. Remember last time it was Russia, which you got Biden family all mixed into the Russia shit. Uh, now it's, I think they're trying to say China this time coming up is, is so that it's just another reason to censor if you have anything, if you're not, not on board with their shit. But uh, yeah, anyway, I, I just, I'm playing like, I please just be some evil, like super, like, you know, um, a villain like you know Doctor Evil or something. They, Someone you could stop. Someone United you could States take him out. down and stop and bring everything back to. No, no, it, like yeah, I don't even care if we can't take him down or whatever. But at least you know it's like legit, not just stupidity. Yeah, but unfortunately, it's dumb. just it's just stupidity. It is just yeah, fucking I really stupidity. Think it is. Hey, it's it, stupidity. Right. It's stupidity and, and like, well, who who are they talking to? I want to know who they're talking to. Who who's your core fucking fan fan base? Because everyone I talk to. All the, the comic book fans and fans of these movies that I talk to are disgusted with these changes and are done. Not even my kids. Yeah. My kids, you're, you're you're making these fucking movies for a generation of kids that don't give a fuck about the characters. Mm-hmm. My kids don't give a shit about who you're putting on the fucking screen. I do. I care to see my classic comic book characters come to life on the screen. Not these bullshit characters I just, that I have no idea who I, the fuck they are. I just heard, um, so I listened to... Um... Uh, a podcast, uh, Tim Cast, right? I like this dude. Um, he, he's a pretty smart dude, but he he finally came on and, and said something the other day on one of the shows, and it's what me and you've been saying forever now. He goes, I, he goes, I'm not. He goes, first off, he goes, I'm not that big of a fan. He goes, I don't care, you know, if you change it black, white, whatever. He goes, but instead of doing that, why don't you just come up with a character for that race? Like, just make the character. Stop changing the shit, you know. That's and that's right. that's my point. Is like stop fucking changing. We got a character that we like that we, it, it's already written. So in my opinion, too, and this is this is another thing. In my opinion, when they fucking change this shit, they're they're giving the middle finger to the artist that actually oh, yeah. created it, right? You're 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 stealing the artist, and too bad Stan Lee ain't alive. Well, I was gonna say, it. do you know you notice when all these major changes in the comic book movies and all the the garbage shit that Disney did and Marvel started doing, you know, when they started really doing it after he yeah. died, when he yeah, died, well, they started and, and changing, changing all his fucking comics. I, and, and to be honest with you, though, I don't know if he made silver surfer or not. He could have regardless, but when, know. when he was alive and involved in the creative yeah. process, they were oh, the, 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 the first couple movies were fucking great. The they first, great. The, the first series up until end game, they were awesome because he was involved in every game, every movie until captain Marvel. Yeah. And then he died. No, and no. then, then, then infinity war and end game. But they were written ready. They were done. But now yeah, he's dead, good. and the new phases of Marvel are garbage because he's not there to be like, just keep it to my own character. These are my. Now Listen, they're like, oh, he's dead. We could do whatever the fuck we want. Terrible. Even with um, 
even with the uh, Doctor Strange, I did like that Doctor Strange one. Yeah, I thought it was pretty good. I'm telling you the the fact that they do that with the with the girl. I, I know the two moms. With my, my two moms. Me, Shut the fuck up. My two moms. My two moms. It yeah. ruined it. That that whole no, I know. It that does. fucking scene Ugh. ruined that whole movie. So my in my personal opinion, I will watch all the comic book movies, even the ones I don't like, up until Endgame. It was Endgame was the last one, right? Well, Endgame was the last one. Yeah, I will watch it all up to end end game, and then I'm done. I'm yeah, done I'm with done. all the shit. I won't this, Disney. This I'm is, done. This is the last want. straw for me. The the Silver yeah. Surfer being a woman is the last straw for me. Now, 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 now wait, 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 wait. Hold on. Let me go on Devil's Advocate here. Um, yeah, she's not bad. If they cast trainer. her and she's just painted like they just hold her down and go, pss, 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 pss. you got nips, everything gone, and just silver. <laughs> she's just in gray okay. paint. Not even silver paint. Yeah. Just gray paint. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Bush everything, right? Like because it's like not paint. even good paint. It's, you can see all the pink in her nipples and everything. It's just yeah, fading yeah, away. Yeah, 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 that's all right. Someone's, like, someone's spritzing her. She's sweating. Can, she's sweating. You can see the streaks running down. Why the fuck did anybody else think about doing this? <laughs> All right, I'm gonna go see this movie. I'm gonna go see this movie. How did they they get away with the PG 13 rating? She's not really supposed to, she's not technically naked. That's just her skin. (laughs) Bravo, Marvel. Bravo. After the first scene, you you walk into that movie theater, you better have a fucking black light. (laughs) Where can I sit? Ah, fuck, I can't sit anywhere in here, man. It's all glowing. Everything's glowing in there. It looks like fucking Avatar. When they walked out, you know, the yeah. Avatar movie. Yeah. The, blue the jungle, the jungle of Avatar. <laughs> <laughs> you look about that. <laughs> it's all dripping off the ceiling. <laughs> Gooey. <laughs> <laughs> Get the fuck out of here. <laughs> right. Guy comes out with an eye patch on. What happened to you? You pirate? Nah, dude. I went into that movie there. I looked up. I saw it. I looked up. <laughs> Next time I'm bringing an umbrella. Fucking gross. <laughs> Rain suit and an umbrella. <laughs> I will say totally that I, I did the see guys the like girl. totally worth it though. Totally worth it. I did see the girl who's who they did cast to play yeah. Silver. So she's not bad looking. Julia Gardner. She's not bad looking, but I don't care. I'm done. Don't I, care. I just because it's not. Fun. She's gonna be. It's gonna be an all CGI version of the like just like the one in uh in the original where she's all silver and mirror. But no, I'm over it. I'm done. Dumb. Dumb. Fuck you, Marvel. You fucking you, you blew it from me. No, not Marvel. Shit. Disney. It's Disney. It's, it's Disney. Disney. But Marvel, you're allowing them to do it. Get the fuck. You made enough money. You could have your own studio. You don't need Disney. Well, they they sold they sold their rights away, so Disney has free. You know, to do whatever Stupid. they want. Uh, I'm, I'm but it will it will Disney. fuck up. Del- it's gonna fuck up Marvel. Um, and then, their sales and everything else. And this is what I wanted to say when you were talking about the guy saying write a, a character for that race. Stop changing all the original characters. And. Everyone will be. Everyone's like, well, "What's the big deal? You're just changing the race. Or you're just making it a woman. Or you just it yeah, doesn't. That's it doesn't, not what it's written. As, but it's and and it douche. doesn't when it doesn't just change the color of their skin or the gender. All right, take Superman for example. He he crash lands in rural America. You change him to a black guy. Let's say you make Superman black. He doesn't grow up on a farm. How could he? He's not going to grow up on a farm anymore with these hick ass parents. He's gonna be yeah. like to be urbanized, and he's gonna grow up in a city somewhere. It changes the entire fucking character of Superman. Yep. Yeah. Okay. You take now you're taking taking fucking the Silver Surfer. You're making him a woman. The Silver Surfer was a badass fucking man. He comes down. He, he surfed around. He did a lot of shit. Now he's a woman. He was fighting. He for saved him. his wife and kid, and that's yeah. what he was fighting for to save his wife and his his woman. Now she is the woman. So what is she fighting for? Just to be a cunt? Just to be a bitch? Like it's fucking yeah. dumb. It changes I mean, the whole fucking save, character. I had to save my male ma- the the males and her because they're you know yeah that's what it, it's it's girl power it's fucking uh um they're still on the bullshit with the uh, toxic masking out um I can't even talk I'm toxic fucking lit, dude. yeah I can see that yeah thank you yeah yeah, yeah, yeah and you got yeah. Oh, man yeah man <laughs> uh, masculinity and it's it's just it's stupid dude it, it's fucking garbage it I want to see. I wish Netflix didn't get rid of uh, Punisher and and uh, no Daredevil. Punisher's it's coming back. One. They're coming. Oh yeah, I want to. Yeah, I know. We'll see. If Disney fucks them up, man. Oh, they're gonna fuck it up, dude. The Punisher's gonna be a woman, trans. He's gonna be a trans man. He's trans. He's transing into a woman. He How do he punishes you by sodomizing you? <laughs> he punishes you by sucking you off. <laughs> you see all these guys lined up to be punished. <laughs> <laughs> all these prisoners lined up to be punished. <laughs> I'm next. I'm next. I'm next, motherfucker. Go my way, motherfucker. I think I'm in a worse crime than you. He needs to punish me first. <laughs> I 
to burn puppies to get punished. Come on. I'm the one who killed his wife and kid. Punish me, motherfucker. <laughs> Punish me bad. Real bad. <laughs> Oh, you're gonna you're gonna get it bad. <laughs> get it bad. You see, puts on special knee pads. Right? <laughs> We're gonna be down here for a minute. This guy's really gonna take a beating. <laughs> and he shows the Punisher. You see the guy put his hands on his head. Whoa, whoa, what the fuck <laughs> you doing? I know what I'm doing. <laughs> I'm punished before. Get the fuck off me. <laughs> they call me the Punisher. You back off. <laughs> they call me the Punisher because I don't know what the fuck I'm doing. He's like, yeah, that's his that's his fucking punishing skill. He stops right before you bust your nut. <laughs> the, the, the skull. The skull is no longer a skull. It's the skull, but it's got a big hole in the mouth. <laughs> no, no, it's not a skull, it's a dickhead. <laughs> <laughs> that's all it is. Oh yeah. fuck. Punisher. I'm punished. <laughs> I'm gonna punish you and you. And I'm gonna punish you. Oh, let's see. <laughs> you, you Dude, I never. Oh, I want to see if I can find that thing. I got it. Did you ever? You never seen that? Uh, the Willy Wonka and the Chocolate Factory? No, no. Okay. No. Well, they took it. They took it down because yeah, no, you've been looking for it because, for weeks. Well, because a stupid movie came out on HBO. Mm-hmm. Let me see if I can find it real quick. Mm. While we're talking. Well, that's that's it. That's it for that. Um, so fuck you, Marvel. Suck yeah, a dick. Uh, I'm done, and now I'm really pissed because now I don't think I'm gonna be able to watch fucking Daredevil because you guys fucking ruin everything. Way to go! And, and I'm really worried about um because I'm pumped up to kind of see uh, uh Deadpool. With oh Will yeah, Rain. I know. And I'm I'm worried that they're gonna because they got rid of the original writers, yep. which is a real red flag. And then I'll just you know Ryan Reynolds, I'm sure he'll sell out a little bit for the money. Yeah. Uh-huh. Uh, but we'll see what happens. It sucks. So why don't you go ahead and suck a dick, Marvel? Go fuck yourselves. Thank you very oh, much. They're like, we already are. We already are, and we love it. <laughs> we love it. <laughs> ah, fuck you, Marvel. Okay, so as you know, as you know, yeah. uh, Friday we experienced uh, an earthquake here in New Jersey. You didn't yeah. feel that. You didn't feel any rumblings, but it was a four point eight on the Richter scale. No, you didn't feel anything. We, but across New Jersey and in New York, everybody felt the earthquake that happened in Lebanon, New Jersey, a four point eight on the Richter scale. And then at six o'clock, a few uh, like tw- like uh, eight hours later, another one, another rumbling from ten uh, from Bedminster, like a four point oh, came through. So. Yeah. And then a little uh, aftershock. I it was I thought it was a truck rolling down the street, but it was a little aftershock shock this morning at like six six o'clock, seven o'clock. Yeah. So we had we dealt with some earthquakes in New Jersey. It was pretty crazy. My my daughter shit her pants. Like I was just fucking around with the dog on the couch, and there was like a bang, like something like blew up in our like hit our house. I thought the fucking quarry behind our house was blowing up, and then it just kept rumbling. I'm like, oh no, this this is a fucking earthquake. Holy shit. Yeah. So. Leah was pumped. She thought it was awesome. Uh, Jenna was shitting her pants, but overall everything was fine. It was pretty interesting. That was fun. And then, uh, but it did. We're talking about all this bullshit for for Marvel and all this woman power and and all this fucking shit. Uh, but the earthquake proved to me that as much as they, as many movie as, as many movies as they put out there, as many as much as they put it out, the woman, you know, uh, girl power and all this shit, putting making all turning all our fucking favorite superheroes into women and all this fucking shit. When push comes to shove, they need a fucking man. Because yeah, yeah dude. Because yes. yeah. what happens yesterday? Fucking or yeah, yesterday. The earth shook. Literally fucking shook and exploded. And and what happens? I'm in the back room. Where do every I have three women in my house, three girls. Where do they all run? Right to me. Right to the yeah. room I'm in. They all what's going on? What's happening? And what are they? They're just looking for the man. Yeah. No, you're you're good. Everything's okay. We're fine. It's just an earthquake. It's all right. Don't worry about it. They're looking for that reassurance. And then I'm sitting there after everything is settled down and everything. My neighbor, Katie, my neighbor and friend, Katie, calls me. Hey, what was that? Was that an earthquake? Yep, it was an earthquake. Don't worry. Everything's good. And what she said, goes, you know, you're the only man on this street today because all the other guys were out working. They were all at work. And, I, and that's when I thought that's when it hit me. I was like, yeah, I'm the only man in the street. But every single movie that comes out now is all about you don't need a man. Women for uh, women power. Yeah, we don't yeah. need men. Fuck men. We don't need them. But your shakes. And all you hold me, oh god, what's happening? Yeah. Is there but meanwhile, meanwhile, you go like this. 
I'm changing. Yeah. <laughs> he did that perfect. You start slowly to change because you haven't been working. Yeah. You turn into right. a woman. I've slowly. been doing my manly shit. I've been swinging my <laughs> hammer. I've been vacuuming and doing dishes. Oh, God, it's happening. <laughs> You know, and I think that the I think that that uh, Julia Garner is going to make a great silver surface. As a matter of fact, Mike. <laughs> yeah. Hey, dude. Wait. Let's get back to this earthquake thing. I want to tell you something. So, there's a fault line that runs all the way down the coast of the United States, right? Like, if you look at back, if you go back and you look at the map from Europe and Africa and everything, and then you look at the map of the United States and South America, it fits together like a fucking puzzle. So we're on a fault line and it, you know, as the years go on, it's going to get worse and worse, but I've experienced, I didn't, I didn't feel this earthquake where we're at in Pennsylvania, but, um, I want to say, man, five or six years ago I was working and, uh, maybe it was longer than that, but we were, we were working and an earthquake hit in South almost, Jersey. It was almost 12 you, years ago. Yeah. Maybe 12 years. It was a long time ago. I just remember I walked in. And you know how you get the back pressure when you open a door in the house, like the back door, if you have the other ha- door and it'll get the wind blowing through, right? Yeah. Well, I'm in there and I'm standing there and I just remember all of a sudden the, 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 all the blinds on the windows start going. Whoa. I'm like, whoa, whoa, shut the back door, right? I didn't realize <laughs> it was a fucking earthquake. And then all of a sudden I start feeling my feet moving like this. And I'm like, oh shit. And I ran out of the house. I'm like, that's a fucking earthquake. And I never forget we had, um, we had like 50 boards of uh, sheetrock, 10 foot, four foot by 10 foot pieces of sheetrock on my back of my buddy's uh, lifted truck. And that truck is going woof, 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 like that. Like I thought it was going to roll over, dude. And I'm sitting there like, oh, fuck, this is a fucking earthquake. It was cool, right? So that's the big one I remember in South Jersey. You probably felt it in your I felt it. I, knew I, slept, you felt through. It. I slept through it. I had my oh, knee okay. surgery. Right. I had knee surgery. I was sleeping. And then you, you call me. You're like you feel yeah. okay? I'm like fuck. I slept yet. Fuck. Yeah, yeah, dude. No, it was cool. But rewind back to when I was a kid, and I want to say probably early '90s, maybe late '80s. I can't remember exactly when it was. I was living in around, not far from where I'm at now, but in Mechanicsburg, right? And me and my buddy Jason and my brother Adam were playing on the back of his porch, and I think I told you this story before. But we're sitting there playing. It's a bright sunny day. And me and Jason were playing G.I. Joe's. I'll never fucking forget it. And all of a sudden, we're sitting there, and uh, the porch was built off the back of his house, so it was sitting probably like five feet off the ground. There was a tree right outside the windows. We're encased. This purple ball of light, um, I'm going to say anywhere from like six to ten feet around. Big fucking ball, purple light, like a lightning ball. It goes, and it wasn't far from us. It may be like ten feet distance from us. It goes from us between his back porch and a tree. And me and my buddy Jason seen it. Adam didn't see it. Like, what the fuck was that? Right? It was it was weird, dude. Fast, but ball a big ass purple ball lightning. Right? Well, at least that's what we thought it was. We didn't know what the fuck it was when we when it happened. But it was a purple ball of light that went between us and the tree. And um, we're sitting there. We stopped playing. Like, what the fuck was that? And uh, we stand up to like to see where it went. And all of a sudden, the house <laughs> shaking real bad. I remember. I never forget. His mom had these spoons on the wall. And they, they start shaking. They fall off the wall, right? It was an earthquake. And mom comes running up and says, what the hell's going on? What's going on? I'm like, I don't know. Purple ball light went by and then the house shook. So never figured that out till uh, I don't know, uh, a little while ago. There was a, a special on uh, on Discovery Channel about ball lightning. Um, well, yeah, yeah. And what it was, is it was about earthquakes. And they said that sometimes the pressure on the rocks is so intense that it magnifies the rocks and they get these things they call plasma balls. And they said they're real rare to see, but they come out before an earthquake. And, uh, yeah, dude, I'm fucking 100, 100% convinced that we've seen a plasma ball shoot out before the earthquake because it did. It shook. It was an earthquake. We felt. and But it's all on the same fucking fault line that you're on and, and all the dude. way down. I think it goes all the way down to Florida. But, uh, yeah, dude, dude. that. that- earthquakes plasma balls it yeah. just it just we ain't shit on this fucking planet you understand and it that's what people are, you thing. ain't goddamn nothing but a piece this of society could fall planet. down in a heartbeat and dude. that's why like you, you and you and all you idiots out there worrying about your genders and your non-binary yeah. bullshit we are a speck of dust on this fucking rock yeah. and if it decides yeah. that we that it 
We are nothing. And, and you're, you're disgusting. You're, you're disgusting this rock. You really are. Bad. And it's good. <sighs> really pushing its buttons. Oh, shit. <sighs> yeah. All right, Mike. Let me look at this fucking video that you sent. Okay, wait, 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 I want to watch it with you, dude. Turn it up loud. It's fucking Wonga, fucking Willy Wanka. Willy Wanka. He <laughs> says, <laughs> It's fucking great. <laughs> right then, who's first? <laughs> Willy Wanka and the Chocolate Factory, yeah. take one. Yeah. <laughs> You must say yes, 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 for weeks, no, literally almost a month. So he's trying to send me this video. Yeah, they they took got it off because they were trying to promote that fucking stupid Willy Wonka movie, and uh, they took this one off. But I found it again. It's and good. It's, it is great. He walks it. Who is first? And it's just yeah. a bunch of big ass black dudes all lifted. He's got one guy's got like he's got like two hundred pound dumbbells. One he's, he's one guy's, the one guy's dancing his pecs. <laughs> That, guys, one was good. Get that was good because <laughs> the way he walks in, who's first? <laughs> completely off. Oh, fuck. Oh, this shit. <laughs> dude, that was good, right? Yeah, that one was good. I'll give you that one. That one was pretty yeah. funny, dude. I'll give you that. I don't know. I don't know who did that skit, but they're fucking funny. <laughs> and that's a nightmare, dude. That's a nightmare. You better start fucking running. You're done. Oh, man, my head's hurting. And the guy goes, as soon as he walks in, he goes, who's first? Willy Wanka, take one, <laughs> click, and he starts filming immediately. <laughs> He's done what? You're done. They're already filming. You're done. <laughs> <laughs> that one, the big dude does sit in there, Pat. He passed the scene and I still thought he died, dude. <sighs> oh. oh, fuck. Fucking gross. <laughs> Man, my head's hurting. <laughs> <laughs> I can't believe I never sent you that shit. Well, you couldn't find I it. Believe. I know. Well, dude, I, it got me so mad. It got me so mad. They fucking took that off. Yeah, but why would they put it back I, on? Because because the movie's on Netflix now and shit, so they it's they stop hiding. Yeah, or Max. I mean, but you know what, dude? I, I that's another thing too. The censoring bullshit. I I it, it aggravates me. Like they censored that shit out. Because and that's not even see. that bad. It's not even that no. fucking bad. No, but they they censored it out. I couldn't find it. Remember how long I was yeah. looking? A day. A full, yeah. No, no, almost two weeks. You looked for that fucking yeah. thing. Solid. Yeah, until it came out, and then they fucking played. So just and that, and that wasn't that even that bad. There's it's 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 nothing bad. It's just a lot of. I mean, it's a disgusting scenario and horrible and nightmare. Oh, it's but fucking horrible. It's, <laughs> that's nothing like yeah, inappropriate. You better run, dude. You turn around to run. The doors are locked. They're chained shut. <laughs> There's two big pit bulls guarded. <laughs> Not the pit bull that dude is doing this. <laughs> He's all angry and shit. <laughs> Trying to leave, motherfucker? Done. I don't think so. Come this way. Oh, no. You're you're you ain't going done. nowhere. <laughs> oh, oh, fuck. Oh, dude. I, dude, this is so <laughs> Yeah, but it's not Who's it's not first? horribly <laughs> the way he comes in. <laughs> but it's not inappropriate. I mean it's disgusting, but it's not inappropriate. And so hey, like, hey, why wait, would wait. you censor it? Yeah, but why yeah, would yeah. you censor it? Like because you're not allowed to laugh at anything, you know. Yeah, you can't I have know. A joke nothing about nothing, anything. yeah, right. Nothing offensive or anything that might someone yeah, might find. Not Willy Wonka. That's been done five thousand times over and over and over again. Yeah. Yeah. Oh yeah, dude. There hasn't been an original movie done in forever. Have you? No, you know? nothing. And no, nothing. I'll, I'll tell you what. I'll tell you what's original and it's good that I've been watching more of. Mar- on Mario's Mar- Mario's the last one I've seen that's original. It's original, but it's not original. They've made Mario yeah. movies before, but uh, yeah, well, movie, the, the, yeah. <laughs> yeah they, it's been garbage. done. It's been done. Uh, what I what I've been watching that's original and a good shit. And I've been watching a lot of it because nothing else is really on is anime. There's a lot of good anime out there. That's oh, stories yeah. are good, 
and uh, it's it's good. I like you don't even realize you're watching a cartoon a lot of times. The best, the best one, um, the best one is the Airbender. Like the seriously, Airbender even yeah, the cartoon is is so. I much did. I watched. All, I watched the whole cartoon. It was great. It it was good, and and like the emotional part, like when the 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 old dude, the the general, when he's talking, like that one episode where he's talking about his son, and you see him like get, like you know, he's you can see you can feel his pain. You right. know, his son died in the war for a useless war. It was good, man. Yeah. I was like, yeah. How come I can't get? How come I'm getting so much more emotion and story out of a fucking cartoon than I am in the fucking live action shit? Like you, you guys can't fucking do it. No. If you and and the fact, like this is the thing that these assholes don't get. Don't try to redo the story and mix it all together. Just leave it out if you can't get get to all of it. You know. Yeah, but leave I don't understand out. why you couldn't get to like the air. I'm thinking of Airbender, the first yeah. season, the first season of the anime show. It's 20 episodes, 20 half, 24 minute long episodes. Yeah. The live action show is 10. Wait, it was 10. Or no, it was eight. I'm sorry. It was eight hour long episodes. So just make the season 10 hour long episodes and you could fit 20 half hour long episodes. In and motherfuckers 10. are going to watch it. You're yeah, because it was back. good. It, I mean, I'll take yeah. out like I take out some of the cornier shit that's in there that you don't yeah, really yeah, need in it. there. But but there's everything the- else in there it was just the story was great. It was yep. great. Like I didn't I didn't like. I, I like the way they find the Kyoshi warriors in the cartoon better than in the like, way, in the way live better, action. way better. Because in the in the, in the yeah. live action, it's oh, if he was the 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 avatar, there'd be a sign. Okay? Yeah, that was stupid. And then, then I'm like, that was dumb. That was a little played out and stupid. Well, the, the, not the, only the, that, the 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 firebender kid, the what's his name? Uh, the Zuko. main main kid, Zuko. Zuko. He's not a fucking cunt in the cartoon. No. You can feel his pain. You see his confusion. You see why he's doing it in a cartoon. But he's by no means a fucking bitch at any moment in there. He's a fucking straight up like f- warrior. He's a warrior right. in that, right? And even the even the fucking um the other kid that I liked uh, the the soccer soccer. He like you watch him grow into the warrior. Right. And he actually starts leading and shit. He's not a fucking douche. He's not a pussy. Right. He fights. He's not as good. He gets his ass kicked a couple times, but the, you see him fucking learn from his shit. Right. And they have the cheesy shit. He is the comic relief in it, but still, like, the character was solid. And I, I just, I like, that cartoon was excellent to me. I love yeah, that. Yeah, the story the was story, great. The whole story was great. And, uh, and, and the, like, finish, the finish of it was fucking good. And they, they've made a follow-up to it. The Legend of Korra is on Netflix. It's 70 years after Avatar. But the, another thing, too. Another thing. Like, in that cartoon... You never find out what happened to the mom, right? No. You assume that she was killed. Um, there's a bunch of unanswered stories. Well, there was which... supposed to be a bunch of like sequels and prequels to the Avatar. No, where they, there was supposed to be a some... film, an accompanying film about Suko's mother and what happened to her. There was supposed to be a film See, about it. You don't need that though. Sometimes that little bit of mystery where you can't find out the shit keeps your imagination moving, which keeps that fucking legend going. So like, like. Take, for instance, like Wolverine, right? Wolverine, they never answered a couple key questions on there. And the movies, they're starting to do shit, like where he came from, why he came from, what's his relationship to fucking uh, Sabretooth. Yeah. In the comics, they never fucking answered that shit. Kept you guessing. Is it his father? Is it his brother? Why are those two fucking... Uh, sometimes that little bit of mystery keeps shit going longer. Well, here, These I, assholes I, keep fucking jumping into the shit and I'll fucking trying to answer example. all the little questions. I'll give you What's a good that? example. Darth Vader. In the first oh, movie, yeah, yeah, Darth yeah, Vader, yeah. of where yeah. he came from, why, where, what made him Darth Vader was a great mystery, a great story, a great thing you had to think of. Like, he heard the stories from Obi-Wan and, and your father yeah. killed Darth Vader and then your father is Darth Vader and like, holy shit, what, what made this guy become like this fucking, the epitome of evil? And yeah. then they made the three prequels, and you and met Anakin Skywalker, and, and found out it. that, and you, and now you Vader's... look at Darth Vader, and you're like, but you're Fine. Anakin Skywalker, you're a whining yeah. fucking bitch. So I'm sorry, where did you turn from a whining bitch to Darth Vader? I don't. There's yeah. no. There's no connection there. He never was yeah. in any of those prequels until the last one where he starts killing kids for whatever reason. It's like, it, but he, not even then, that. That was weak. What was it? Was it? weak. <laughs> He, he had and no it, reason to go in there and kill the kids. He never it becomes it, 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 like it would have been cool if you saw him as Anakin, and then over the next three movies, you could see a gra- like the darkness turning and like why he's dark and evil and what you yeah. know he eventually turns because Padme dies and all that. But it was dumb. It was horrible, and it ruined ruined Darth Vader. 
it ruined it. It did it. It took one of the top. Uh, I, I tell everybody this. It took one of your best and strongest fucking villains ever, like one of the most feared villains oh, ever. Oh, feared. Like, and turned him about into it. a complete fucking Santos. Yeah, a pussy. Dude, think, <laughs> think about it. Think about it. I hope Santos listens to this shit. <laughs> think what about it. Fuck? Whenever you're drunk, you start ripping on Santos. Whenever you've had a few drinks, you start turning yeah, into yeah. Santos. Uh, but, but think about it. Darth Vader, he was Go nothing on. but like a robot. Like he's a mask. Nothing really scary about his mask. But if yeah. if Darth Vader walked through, you were terrible. You were shitting your pants as a kid when you heard the music from Darth Vader. Dun, 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 dun. You shit your pants. It was scary. But then yeah. now you think, oh, here comes Anakin fucking Skywalker. Yeah. Ooh, fucking pussy. I know where you come from now, about You ain't so scary. I know your origin. You're a yeah. pussy. Bag. All right. Good. Good. Go cry about Padme some more. Ooh. Ooh. Play fucking your, cunt. your fingernails are done underneath those yeah. gloves, douche. Fucking douche. <laughs> yeah, they paint those metal fucking robot hands of yours, you fucking queer. <laughs> And then, uh, like and then, uh, even the last one they did with, um, uh, uh, Princess Leia and fucking what's his name's, uh, kid. Yeah. Yeah. That was, I mean, done for nothing. Like they did it better. I'm going to give you that. Like the special effects made the movie a lot better, but he was still turned into a whiny cunt. He did. He like, did. He was yeah. a whining bitch. And it's he's like, again, he starts off bad, like Kylo Ren. You're like, all right, this guy's a badass. Kind of yeah. reminds me of Vader a little bit. And then he takes yeah. off the mask and you're like, and you ruined it. You just fucked. Left no it. reason to take that again. Mask off. Again, the best part about Vader, you didn't see his face until the last ten minutes of the last fucking yep. movie. This kid takes his mask off in the first fifteen fucking minutes. It's where they fucked up on the Mandalorian too. Should have never taken his never mask taken off. his mask off. See, no, they need Vader. To take- you didn't. When did, you didn't see Vader, Vader had his mask on the entire movie. You didn't know what is until the very end of fucking Return of the Jedi. When he's yep. walking him out right before he dies, he takes his mask off. And that's and, it. And, and then and what was uh I, I keep saying it. And like these assholes got you know, these actors and shit. The guy uh I can't never I can never remember his name, but the guy that did Judge Shred, the not not uh Stone, Carl Urban. The, Carl Urban. He played that Judge Shred. He did a fucking excellent job, dude. And I never knew it was him. I didn't know it was him, but he did a good fucking job because Judge yeah. Shred never takes his fucking mask yep. off. That guy yeah. played the part. He didn't need to have his face on there. Yeah. And then guess what? Us as fans, we appreciate you as an actor more when you play yep. the part. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah. Yep. And Not play like it better Will than Smith. just fucking do shit up. Will Smith taking the, the coolest thing about his character was the mask and he never yeah. wears it. Never more. Like, never more. Go see it's me, the old Will Smith. Yeah, exactly. No, no, it's a black man playing dead, dead, just, uh, dead shot. Yeah, you're fucking stupid. I'll tell you what, there was one, one gender swap that they swapped him and. Because I didn't really know much about the character to begin with, but they gender swapped him, and I never, never noticed it because I didn't know the character before. And yeah. it, as far as I know, Nick Fury has been a black man, but in the original comics, Nick Fury is not a black man. Oh, I knew. No, that that took me a while to get used to. I, I like. Uh, I didn't see. I didn't, I didn't. I didn't know Nick Fury until like Samuel Jackson and like Nick, the, the Nick new Fury cartoons. has hair like me, all gray on the sides. Yeah, and yeah. Shit. And, yeah. yeah. And, see again, that one. Sam Jackson did a good job in it, uh, but you know, again, I I was a little disappointed that they did that, but he he fucking brought the character to the thing. Yeah, were able to that was a, that it. was I'll give him that was the one gender swap that worked only because you got a, a great actor to play the guy the character. You got the perfect. Yeah. he was the perfect black man to play Nick Fury. Yeah, yep. But Nick Fury, I still would have wished they would have kept Nick Fury. Nick Fury. Yeah. Now, now here's a question: If they kept Nick Fury as the white man. Who do they I'll cast? You, who do they cast? I'll tell, you, cast. I'll tell you who would have been perfect for it is uh the guy who played Thanos. Yeah, but then who's played Thanos? If you they got if got, you got Josh he Brolin, did a fucking he did a good job as Thanos, but they could have gotten some anybody to do Thanos because they you know it was a lot of cosmetic shit. Yeah, but, but I mean Josh Brolin's voice as Thanos was perfect. Yeah, it was, but he, his look as Nick Fury is perfect. Perfect. Yeah, he does with the yeah. side. With the sides, the shaved sides and everything on his hair. Yeah, yeah, yep. yeah. He he would have looked. He would have been the perfect. But it, uh, but wait, but did you ever see at the end of um, uh, the second the the uh, Dawn of Justice, the Superman, Batman, Dawn of Justice movie with Ben Affleck and all that shit? Yeah. At the end, they do an after credit scene with uh, Jesse Eisenberg. With uh, the, he's a uh, you know he's Lex Luthor. He's on his yeah, boat. I hate and, that fucking kid. I know, I know, but he's on his boat, and Deathstroke comes on his boat. 
and it's like oh, it's an older Deathstroke. It's great hair, great beard. It's Joe Mangalione. I don't know who that is. Yeah, he played Flash in the original Spider Man movie. Played the bully Flash in the original Spider Man movie. Yeah, the accent's I'm breaking me breaking your face when Spider Man Tobey Maguire fights the kid yeah. the very first time. Oh, when he's like, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's that's Joe. But I saw him when he comes out as Deathstroke. He's got the eye patch, gray hair, like kind of spiked up, and like the beard kind of looks like Nick Fury. I'm like, yeah. he could play Nick Fury. Yeah. Well, Deathstroke kind of looks like Nick Fury. Yeah. I'm saying they always that, did that, the half. They always, they always took comic books. Right, right. But I'm saying Deathstroke I'm, and fucking uh, uh, Deadpool and yeah, right, yeah. right. But like him coming out when I saw him, I'm like, okay, now he and he's a big dude, so I'm like, he could play Nick Fury as a white guy. So could have yeah. done it. You could have done it. But I'm. That's one I will say. It worked. You gender swapped, and yeah. it worked. Well, like, and, and, it doesn't and happen. In Marvel, this. Marvel's looking for the name to bring people in to watch. That's why they took Sam. Sam. Sam and he was good. Sam. And he was just good. Just the, his whole yeah. demeanor and just the way he acts. He was good as, as Nick Fury. I'll yeah. Give him, that. him him and Robert Downey Jr. were probably the best the best two out of the whole. Cast of the first. They yeah, cast it as a well, team. And, and I, I will give credit for the Captain America dude, too. He and did Thor. a good job. The, the original casting of the Avengers was very good. Well, Thor... Thor, they kind of did a comedy relief thing with a lot of Thor. So yeah, yeah. I mean, he he looked the part, but looked the part. Uh, that's what I'm saying. Yeah, uh, the, you want to get in the good casting though. Good casting. I'm gonna I'll get to give it to Netflix when they did Daredevil and they did Punisher and they did Kingpin. Yeah, that was Kingpin fucking was great. Great, he's great. He's that great dude, as, yeah, as Kingpin. Vince he did a good owner, fucking yeah. job. Yeah. So the Daredevil and King and uh, Punisher too, though those yeah. guys were fucking perfect for the part. Yeah. Let's hope Disney does not fuck that up, man. That's your last. That is your last. That's it, man. I'm 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 not gonna go see Fantastic Four. I will go see Deadpool. I'll give that a shot, and then I will try yeah. De- Daredevil. If you fuck them up, I'm canceling my Disney Plus subscription. I will cancel it. Oh, uh, dude, I think you should cancel it anyway. Um, uh, I'm, I'm still done. I, I'm, I'm still done. It, I'm going with Daredevil. I'm gonna give Daredevil. A shot, but if they fuck that up, I'm out. I'm canceling. What What are they doing with Daredevil? Like, it's not going to be as good as Netflix. Well, you know that, right? I know that. I know that. But if it's decent, we'll see. But it's everything. Supposedly, everything that happened on Netflix is all. It's all part of the show. It's all canon. Yeah, but they ain't gonna fucking hold on to that violence. No, there's no way. There's no fucking fucking way. We'll see. We'll see what happens. Douchebag. They're gonna fucking gay it up. Daredevil's gonna be sucking a dick on the side. Um. New suit, new uh, outfit's dead, gonna be all rainbow. The Deadpool Wolverine movie is gonna be a big telltale of how Daredevil's gonna be. Because if that's violent and gory and like the old, like the original two Deadpool movies, then there's hope that Daredevil can be as as violent as the original. I I really don't think it's gonna be. I I, I hate to say it. We'll see. I don't think it's happening. Keep my fingers crossed for that one, dude. That's my last. That's that's my last shine and hope is right there. Is that is that fucking Daredevil movie? That Daredevil Daredevil, Daredevil show. So we'll see. We'll see. I can't think there's there's not too many movies. On. I haven't been excited about anything. In I'm a not long excited time. about anything. Like Kong I'm Kong really not even. No, nope, I don't even care about that, dude. Right, like, right, honestly, I was, and Dune. I was Dune. When Dune, 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 I, nice. Dune I want to see Dune because the first one was cool. Um, like I said, Daredevil, Wolverine. I mean, um, uh, uh, um, Deadpool and Wolverine. I want to see, but. Everything else, no, there's, after there's that. and like I'm thinking tonight, like what am I gonna watch tonight? There's nothing even good on like anything streaming. Well, I'll go and I'll watch anime. That's what I'm gonna do. I'm not gonna play any video games because I'm a little drunk and I don't play video games and I'm a little drunk. And uh, oh, I'll dude. just watch. I'll watch fucking uh, anime shit. I'm uh, yeah, the anime. It, oh, dude, if you want to watch a cool anime, there's one called. There's an old one. You ever watch Akira? No, but you know what I want to watch? I've been seeing it's an old one. Is My Hero Academia? No, no, no. Akira is older than that. Yeah, I know. Check out Akira, dude. Look that one it. up. I gotta find it. Yeah, you'll find wow. it. It's one of the top fucking movies ever for anime. Oh, it's a movie. Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. It's a movie. Um, it, it starts off like I. It's it's brutal, brutal, violent. But it starts off like you're gonna be watching this movie. You're like this is fucking cool, and then uh, it gets to a point where like. It just cuts and it goes full out fucking anime, like Japanese anime. You're like, what the fuck just happened? What just happened? Wait, what, I, how does, you it can't starts stop off like what? It starts off like what? It's cool. You're going to be following the story. You're going to be like into it. And then there's this, this line of like where you're like, what the fuck just happened? What happened? Who's that? Why? 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 What's what's going on here? But it's still cool. And you still end up watching it. 
What, are you looking up a cure? No, I'm I'm looking up this movie that I, I used to watch. Uh I gotta see if this is the right one. I think it is. Fire I used to watch, no, no, it was this movie that I watched. I used to watch it as a kid. I gotta see if this is the one. And I, I loved it. It was a uh, the story was I can't really remember, but the fucking it was really cool. Did you ever watch Fire and Ice? No. You didn't? Yeah, you did. You had to have, dude. Not this one. Fire and Ice. Yeah, that's a cool one. Watch that one if you haven't seen it. That no. that I'm sure you did, if you because you're you're an eighties kid. You had to watch that. Pretty brutal. Like they animated over live actors. It's pretty weird, but it's yeah. cool. It's a good story. I can't yeah. I can't find it, but it was it was a cool show, a cool movie. What was it about? What was it? What was it? About? I forget. It was it was weird, but she ends up riding this girl ends up riding these like giant like worm things. It was weird. I I just I remember very. I watched it when I was real young, but I remember I watched it a lot. I was yeah. This is I don't really know what the fuck is going on here, but visually it's really cool. So I forget. Fire oh, nice. Maybe it is fire and ice. No, it's not fire and ice. I don't know. Fire and ice is like that wizard comes back. He's like a necromancer. He pulls up the dead army and shit. And uh, it's a fucking cool movie. It's like a barbarian kind of thing. It's it's cool. Dude, look up fire and ice. Check that out. That's a good one. But Akira, fire and ice. And then another, another old ass uh, excellent fucking anime thing is Ninja Scroll. That's a cool one. Yeah. Yeah. Nice. I, I gotta check out some anime because I like it. It's fun to watch. Yeah, yeah. Some of it's good. Some of it sucks. Well, I've been watching. I started watching Castlevania, but it got kind of lame. Yeah, no, it gets gay, dude. It's so I was like, I'm out. I'm out. It's boring. Yeah. I'm falling asleep a lot to it. So I'm out. So I started watching this new one. Which one did you get to? Did you get to the second season where yeah. fucking, they fucking yeah. they gate up fucking? No, I didn't even get that far. I got like a la carte, a card. Yeah, I didn't, I, I didn't get. I got like maybe like two episodes into the second season, and I was falling asleep. But I was I started watching this new one, uh, Mysteries of Arvos, the Dragon Prince. It's pretty good so far. Sokka, the guy, the guy who does the voice of Sokka is in it. I'm trying to think on Netflix. Yeah. There's wait, what is it called? The Dragon Prince. Oh uh, wait a minute, wait, is that with the baby dragon? Yeah, the, the dragon egg. I started watching that at Nico, and then I stopped. Oh yeah. Yeah, they gay it up, of course. Yeah, it has to be fucking gay in it. it. Has to be fucking fag in it. Yeah. Yep. You'll see. You'll see. Yeah. You get into it. Not not just in one spot. In a couple different spots. And I'm like, why? Why? Yeah, why? Why? And there, yeah, there was another one. Um, they did. It was cool. We started watching. Was uh, it was like these mutant uh people that lived underground. And the one girl gets out on top. She ends up finding out she's mute. I forget what it's called. It was really good. We were getting into it, and then I had to stop. I was like, hey, they're pushing the fucking bullshit again on the kids. Done. Done. Yep. I'm fucking out. Meh. Yep. My kids are, wow. are good, though. They're they're older and they don't. No, your kids are old stuff. enough to know better, but that's the problem. It's like at the at the impressionable age. The developmental age. They're fucking with their brains. Yeah, that's what they're doing. And that's the shit that they're trying to put it out on all this shit. And, I, you know, you have to even watch with video games. Speaking of video games, hey. how far did you get in? I got a war. I'm at a spot. Yeah. I, it, it's tough. It's tough, man. It's fucking hard. I'm. I'm. I haven't gotten far yet, but I'll get there. All right, I'm watching. The, um, my my daughter's. My Leah bought GTA. She's like, I want GTA Grand Theft Auto. And I know it's a fucking. It's an an adult. You know, a very mature game. She's playing it. Yeah. And I'm down there doing something. I forget. What I was. Oh, I think I was getting ready to play the Oculus. And she comes on and she gets onto this thing. And she goes, Oh my god! And I look up and it's the guys in the strip club and it's just titties. Everyone was just dancing his titties on him. I'm like, no, Leah, no, what are you doing, Leah? Ah, and I'm standing in front of the TV, and this guy's just getting a lap dance with fucking, you know, like pretty real looking titties on a fucking video game. I'm like, oh my god, no. And my and Jenna's down there, she's like, what? Oh, I'm like, no, no, girls, don't watch this. Stop it. Bad game, bad. And they're like, hey, you can make money for showing your boobs. No, you fucking can't. No, stop. No. One of my buddies from high school did voiceover acting for Grand Theft uh, Auto. Um, it was the Miami one. Five? All right, five, four or five. Yeah, he was one of the characters in that shit. Uh, yeah, he probably won't get in a lap dance with the big-ass titties in his face. <laughs> <laughs> Brad, I like this. Oh, what the fuck was it? Uh, Brad Schmidt. 
Yeah, the one yeah. in uh, the one in uh, Yellowstone, right? Yeah, yeah, he was in. Uh, uh, I guess he was in an episode of that. I didn't see it. He he did the commercial. There was an old commercial out there. It's old now, but it was a commercial where it's like uh, these two, the lady and the guy waiting, hanging out on the beach. They're all relaxed. He's like, "Honey, did you shut the windows?" He's like, "Yeah, I did." And uh, I guess it was something like you could do it by the control on your phone. But all meanwhile, it's all these birds and stuff. And <laughs> shit. <laughs> so, I was saying we're watching. I'm like, man, that motherfucker looks like somebody I don't. Oh shit! You know, and <laughs> guy I went to high school with in Pittsburgh. Yeah, nice. Yeah, he, he's a cool dude. Uh, his brother, I knew his brother better. His younger brother better than him. Um, he, he used to hang out and party with Adam and Jimmy all the time. But yeah, they were they were cool guys. Nice. There was two motherfuckers in my school up, up when I went to Pittsburgh that were shredded up like all the girls loved. One was my buddy Jed. He was a football player. He was, he was fucking, you know, just all chiseled up. And then Brad. Brad was fucking chiseled up. Motherfuckers. Got it easy. Easy. <laughs> fucking pricks. I'm going to kick, I'm gonna kick, their, I'm gonna kick, their, kick the shit out. Just show them. You muscles don't make shit. <laughs> <laughs> you motherfuckers. <laughs> they may be in great shape, but I beat the fuck out of both of them. <laughs> How dare you get famous, fucker. <laughs> Take that pretty face. Come here, motherfucker. <laughs> You got so pretty family? no more, are you? you it's so pretty family? anymore, are you? Yeah. Huh? Who's gonna hire you now, motherfucker? <laughs> As you're walking, I'm like, huh. this fucked his life up, man. That was that was kind of wrong. <laughs> Shit, I got to, I got to tell people I know that guy. <laughs> Fuck. Now I can tell people I fucked his life up. <sighs> nah, he, he's a cool dude though. I talk to him about like jujitsu and shit every once in a while. I get him on Facebook and stuff, but yeah, yeah, man, he he did a lot of good shit. He's been yeah. doing. He, he worked with a. Uh, it's fucked up because I know all the shit he did, but I haven't watched, you know, I'm bad with watching shit. I haven't watched all of it, but he did. He uh, just, he just talked shit on everything he did. Yeah. No, 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 no. Okay, shit he's I, in is terrible. This is the best movie I've ever seen. <laughs> My buddy's in it. <laughs> but, uh, he, did, <laughs> he did, um, um, he was in a couple of those machete movies. Oh yeah. 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 When it goes to space and shit. Oh yeah. Machete I didn't do that. In space. <laughs> I didn't know yeah. That. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he gets some. He gets some shit though. He's 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 staying constant and working. Hollywood he's keeping busy. He's getting a but he started. Up. I guess he like after high school and shit. He went into and I didn't know. I like you know, dude. You you like I I you just don't know what everybody's doing, and then you find out later. It's like Clint. You know, Clint was doing all that crazy shit. We didn't know, yeah. but uh, he was doing like Broadway plays and shit. I'm like, oh yeah, that's pretty big for somebody doing yeah. soap operas. He was, he yeah. started off in soap operas. I'm like, oh shit. Yeah, well, fuckers doing good. Yeah, it's pretty good. Yeah, it's cool when you know people do that. You know. Yeah, like so people who tell you know, and people say they know us. I know the blue yeah, collar yeah. schmucks. Like when Campbell goes out to Campbell goes out to everybody. I know the blue collar schmucks. Who? I get a who? discount here. I get a discount. <laughs> He's over. Because this is the blue collar schmucks. But one at one ninety nine. Yo, I know the blue collar schmucks. I mean, they talk hey, all the time. You guys listen to the blue collar schmucks? No. Oh. <laughs> I know those guys. Project I extra. <laughs> put an name, asshole tag. Name drop it. Yeah, put an asshole tag on it. He's name dropping a couple of fucking losers. Who the fuck are the blue collar schmucks? <laughs> Who fucking cares? You know Moy Yeah, tax him. Tax him. Do tax him. Do asshole tags. <laughs> Charge him double. He's a fucking idiot. He's even wearing a shirt. What a dick. What a douche. <laughs> would you get that? Would they give that to you for your birthday? You douche, <laughs> fucking douche, and you actually wear it. You're a fucking douche. <laughs> <laughs> Meanwhile, Santa's over there with teary eyes. Thank you, me. I killed for that fucking shirt. <laughs> Santa's <laughs> <laughs> sitting with his bottom lip up. <laughs> like a kid not trying not to cry. It's, it's quivering. The whole time it's quivering. Here, Mike, we got your shirt. I don't want it. Bring your shirt out in front of Santos, right? He gets you see him. He gets all excited. You throw it to Here you go, Shadow. Here you go, Sean Here you go, Dan. It's all you, buddy. 
It's cool, guys. I do well with it anyway. <laughs> not not shot about Steve. Can <laughs> <laughs> we hold it up? Who gets a double XL shirt? <laughs> Steve, it's all you, buddy. <laughs> Wear this to bed every night like a nightgown. <laughs> we go camping in this motherfucking thing. <laughs> Oh man, that's hurting. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh, shit. shit. So that's it on uh, Wanker. Willie, Wa- yeah, Willie, w- and, the, Willie, Willie Wanker <laughs> and the Chocolate <laughs> right. Factory. I don't even think that's we how, the, about that's how that whole fucking thing started. Willie Wanker and the <laughs> Chocolate Factory. <laughs> oh, dude. Oh, uh, shit. <laughs> So, dude, I want to get into uh, you, you playing that game a little bit. What's that? That uh, Thanos. God of War? Or not God of War. I mean, God of War, not Thanos. <laughs> not um, that. Kratos. Thanos. Not God of War. Uh, not God of War. God of War. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So you, you just got through the intro and shit. Did you fight any of the... the... I fought one god. He, like, what was uh, I don't Did know. Do you have what? tattoos all over him? Yes. Okay. So right. it, it just starts off... You start off and your 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 wife and the kid's mother just died. Okay. And and, and you, I'm assuming this takes place after all of the other games. He's already fucking slaughtered every other fucking god known to man. He's killed. He's, the, he's destroyed. The, he's ready. He's the god the, of war. The he's Greek killed gods. the Greek gods. He's the god of war. Yeah. He's gone through all that. He's gone shit into with hiding. The gods. Yeah, and now he's in hiding. Okay. And so, you, but you don't really know that. It just starts off with him, and he, he's yeah. taking his son out hunting. The mother dies, and he's carrying a, a log to make the the her her pyre out of. And then he they light her on fire, and then they go out hunting. And then he kills a deer, and then he come back to your house, and th- it just it's just a, you. I have no idea what what the purpose of the game is or anything. You just you're okay. out, and the woman dies, and you go back. You hunt this deer. You, the the kid kills the deer. And then you come back, you collect her ashes, and then you gotta you're gonna take her ashes up to the mountain. But before okay. that, uh, there's a knock on the door, and this guy's there, and he's like, uh, he starts fucking with talking shit to you and punching you in the face. And Chris is like, What the fuck, man? Little skinny like, dude, right? Yeah, and he's like, he just keeps punching the Chris, dude. Then get the fuck out of here. And uh the guy's like, Ah, come on, man, fucking hit da-da, shit talking shit or whatever. And then he finally like Kratos unloads on him, like fucking rocks guy, and the guy's like, ah, finally. And he's like, my turn. Boom. And he fucking rocks since Kratos fucking flying. And then he had this epic battle. And he's a, and that's when I figured out like, this guy's a fucking God. And he's talking yeah. shit. And I'm like, he's talking about his brother and Thor and Odin. And I'm like, All right, is this Loki? Am I fighting Loki right now? And then he, he, I beat him. And uh, then you go on this mission. And you're going to take this fucking, this, your wife's ashes up to this mountain. And still, I've fought a couple of monsters and a couple of, of creatures and shit. And I met this witch who's telling me, like, you know, I know you're a god. I know you're not of this realm. Uh, they don't like they're they're, they're going to find you. And I guess you're figuring out that like the Norish gods, they don't they're they're going to yeah. come after him now. And it's the Norish gods, so like the Viking gods of Odin and Thor and Loki. And I've only fought one of them so far. So it, it's a long game because I've I've it's a long fucking game. And uh, I've been playing there's... it for a while, and it's like. There's a lot going on, man, and I'm. It's hard because I'm. Guys are fucking tough, and the control. I don't like. I'm not big on the controls because, like, I gotta move and I gotta turn the, c- the camera, so like, you can't lock on guys. So if I'm fighting a guy and he jumps up, flies up, and flies behind me, I gotta look all around to find him because I can't lock on. Yeah. Him. I just follow him around, which I don't. I'm not a big fan of. So Dude, just tough. just keep with it. Don't stop because, uh, yeah, you you got some shit coming at you, like uh, some of the shit you're saying, and I just can't wait to you figure out who's who. Yeah, it's it's cool. It's a cool game. I love the God of War games. And if they were ever going to make a movie of a video game, it should be God of War. Just don't do do not fuck it up because any one of the stories of any one of these games is a great fucking story. Don't fuck it up. They they got to. um, That's the problem with the video games. Like it's all about getting a big name in there, and then not. Well, you know who's going to play Kratos? Probably be the fucking Rock. Will probably play Kratos. Nah, he's he wouldn't be good for Kratos. No, he wouldn't. They need to. It's got to be a no yeah, name. You got to be someone you don't never yeah. fucking know. Somebody's gonna try, but not not as no name as like Netflix does with Avatar, where they can't. No, act. well, it's got to be a no name, someone that nobody really knows, but it's someone who can actually fucking act. Yeah, I'll play. I play Kratos. I, I always thought Kratos would be the perfect fucking character for me to play. Angry and miserable all the time, pissed off, oh, and yeah. full of rage. It's just it's perfect for me. It's perfect for me. 
Well, this new one, it, it's pretty cool because he's... This is Ragnarok, right? The one for PS4? It's Ragnarok? That's what it's called? Yeah. Because it doesn't say yeah, yeah. Ragnarok on it. It just says God of War. But it is Ragnarok because they mentioned Ragnarok in it. Wait a minute. They re- mentioned it. You're not at Ragnarok yet. I think the next one is Ragnarok. So yeah. there's two of these, right? Yeah. And the stories go together good. Um, But this one here, you got... This one here is cool because you don't know who's who. And you start figuring shit out. And... uh. And the next, you know, I don't want to, I'm not going to tell you much, but just keep playing it. You'll get this, good. And this is coming from someone. He doesn't want to spoil it for me. He's never even played the fucking game yet. No, but I watched everything on it because I, again, I don't have the PlayStation to do it. Uh, otherwise I would oh, play this game. Yo, next time it's you come, first. you, you want to play next time you come, come to my house, we're going to go over to this place called Gans Media in Hopakon. Yeah. yeah. You know, you'll bust a nut. There's so many fucking old school retro <laughs> games and systems in there. Dude, uh, I've, been I just, there, I've been there. I found out about this place last week. I've been there three times in the last week. Let me tell you something. I just upgraded our uh, our our Switch yearly subscription to the. Uh, oh, you did the family the, thing. The, yeah, well, no, we had the family. The oh, but you did family, that yearly the fifty dollars. The, the fifty dollars yeah. a year thing. Yeah. So you get this, the N sixty four fucking. I got thing. Nintendo sixty four, and I got Sega Genesis now. Yeah, and they have they have um. They have the uh, Shinobi on there. Oh yeah. Oh, uh, dude. I'm. I can't. Everybody goes to bed tonight. Like I don't give a fuck what I got to do tomorrow. <laughs> that that Shinobi is. I beat that game back in the day on my Sega Genesis. I remember it. But you fight Batman and you fight Spider Man in it. It's fucking oh, yeah. awesome. Oh nice. yeah. You never played that? No. I played oh, Shinobi, dude, but I don't a... know if I fought. I remember the, the Spider Man game though for for PlayStation for Sega. It was cool. No, 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 no. The Spider Man was good. You fight Kingpin at the end, and yeah. or Venom was the last guy. Yeah. Kingpin and then Venom. Um, that was one of my favorite games too. But Shinobi's cool because they they bring you're like you're fighting, right? And all of a sudden you're fighting. It doesn't say Spider Man, doesn't say Batman, but it's obviously Spider Man and Batman. You're like, oh fuck, play Spider Man, <laughs> right? Yeah, and it's cool, dude. It's cool. That game was that was a good game, dude. That that was good. I love the Shinobi game because Ninja Gaiden is one of my all time favorite games. Even though I never beat that game, love it. Love Ninja Gaiden, uh, but that all comes from Shinobi. Yeah. You ever play Ninja Gaiden? Did you beat yeah. it? No. Oh yeah, I got all the way to the last guy, dude. Last guy, you had to fight your dad. I beat my fucking dad, and then I died on the last guy, and it started me all the way back. I'm like, fuck this, right? <laughs> I know. It is so upsetting yeah. when it happens. Uh, oh, and so they upsetting. send you so far back. You're like, fuck yeah, it was so impossible to get to that. But yeah, what a great game. Because the cutscenes, I remember playing that game. Like, we'd be up all night playing that, me and my friends. It was me, Adam, and my buddy Jason. We we're playing uh, playing that fucking game. And they do the cutscene. It was the first time, like, they did cool cutscenes in a game. And uh, tell you, like, the comic book, and they play that cool music and shit. Yeah. Well, that's, yeah. that's the God of War. The, the games nowadays, the cutscenes are so seamless from the gameplay. Yeah. Like, I'm watching it, and it goes to a cut. Like, I'm, you know, I got the controls, and I'm moving them. And then it gets a cutscene. I'm like, oh, okay. And I could stop moving him, but I'm still pushing the controllers. I'm like, oh. And then yeah. I, I'm, I'm trying to move him this way, but he's walking this way. I'm like, oh, this is a cutscene. Okay. So now I'm but, watching. And, and it looks, the graphics are so good. It's on so it good. And, and it's it's like the cutscene and the gameplay, the graphics are like I, the same. So I'm watching it and you're watching the cutscene. You're like, okay. And then it goes back to gameplay, but he's still talking to the kid and the kid's still talking. And I'm he's just standing there. And I'm like, I would love to standing. see them take the original God of War. And update the graphics to what they are today on that original God of War. That would the gameplay of that was the gameplay of that God of War was so fucking great. It was so awesome. Oh, it was so cool. And and not only that, just the story. I remember coming up on the part where the guy's digging a grave and you're talking to him. He's like, What are you what are you doing? Because I'm digging your grave. And you get to the part where you end up in Hades and you fucking dig out and you end up coming out later yeah, in the game. Yeah. And you're climbing yeah. out of that fucking grave. Over all the bodies. Oh, you're climbing shit. up, you're climbing up the yeah. bodies. Yeah. All yeah, the yeah, fucking yeah. like what? Yeah, that was a good. And, that's another great story. Fucking, yeah, his wife and killed, and then he's covered with their ashes. That's why his skin yeah, is yeah. gray. And you're yeah. fucking to get extra energy in the beginning, like you yeah. fucking do two bitches at the same time in the bed. I was like, it's first time I saw fucking... titties in a video game. <laughs> oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Like... King, king, king. <laughs> Pause. Uh, yeah, I can. I can work to that. That'll work for me. <laughs> Oh, yeah, it was such a great. They're all boxy and shit, yeah. squared off. Yep, not anymore, dude. Not anymore. Not in a PS4. They ain't no boxy titties. No, no, no. They look good. I was uh, when Leo was playing that game. I'm like, get go, go, both you guys, go upstairs. This is inappropriate. Go upstairs and lock the door. 
Go up there. Daddy needs some me time. Throw that some this. lotion while you're up there. Hurry up. <laughs> where's Where's that conditioner at? <laughs> <laughs> Nobody uses controller for a little while, all right? Yeah, clean it. <laughs> Dad, the controller's stuck. <laughs> They turn it on, <laughs> like you know when you when you turn to get like Nigo did it. If you hold, if you hold the, 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 the yeah, yeah, yeah. It locks it in. Guys, just he just <laughs> run into a wall. He won't stop running forward. Yeah, my bad. <laughs> <laughs> Let me clean that for you. Hang on. <laughs> <sighs> no black lights down here. Okay, it's the only rule. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, shit. Uh. <laughs> you got anything else? Um, what was I going to say? Oh, I did have a mental moment. I was just going to go over this real quick. Okay. Okay. Right? So so uh, we had all this rain this week, right? Horrible rain, right? So I'm like, eh, I ain't going to be doing much, man. Nobody's going to be doing a roof in the rain, right? You think downpouring rain? I went out the other day. Fucking Amish motherfucking douchebags. The Amish, these guys maybe hate all the Amish. Okay, these these group of three fucking dudes. It was a dude and two young kids, and I hate them now. Right? I get out there, I pull in. It's a narrow fucking driveway. It's downpouring rain. I got to get out. I got to cut fucking branches and trees away to get in there. Right? I'm like, <laughs> and I get now at, at work. I, I said. I, I told him last week, I'm like, yeah, dude, I think this is a ground drop. This, 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 look at this. I said, there's power lines. There's the, all these trees. I said, this is a ground drop job. We can't get in there with the crane. No, I get sent out and I'm fucking fuming. I should have just went back. I should have just said, sorry, I can't do it. But I didn't, I did it. I get out. I like, give me your saws all. I'm up there cutting back fucking limbs on trees and shit like <laughs> this fat around. Right. I didn't give a fuck. I, I butchered this guy's trees up to get in there. I back up. I'm like, I'm putting shit up on there. These motherfuckers start ripping, ripping this guy's shingles off down pouring rain, down fucking pouring rain. And it lasted for a good hour and a half after I left, dude. They were doing his, this guy's roof. The guy comes out. He's like, yeah, you know, I didn't think it was good. I said, really? They're doing your roof today? Like, like saying, maybe tell them to fuck off. Yeah. You open that roof up, go. you're going to get tons of water. And you, even if you fucking, what do you put it down in the fucking rain? It, whatever. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, dude. I mean, like, they're ripping the shingles up. So you're pulling the paper up. Now you got all the seams exposed. Mm-hmm. Water's going down in there. Yeah. Right? I retarded, dude. So these were the fucking inbred Amish that I worked with this weekend. This was like brother, sister, love, and creation nice. and shit. Nice. Yeah. Yeah. So I was fucking, I get back. I get back, dude. I, at where I work, I'm like, I'm going off like, fuck this fucking place. I said, you fucking send me out there. I'm all fucking soaking wet for what? <laughs> I told you, like, nobody wanted to be around me there. I get the salesman out there. I'm like, I said, next time these motherfuckers tell you something, I said, you can fucking tell them. I said, look at me, Jim. I said, you tell motherfuckers no. Like that, right, dude? I said, because he's a, he's a salesman. He's a fucking, you know, and yeah. yes to everything, right? Yes yep. to everything. Because they don't do it. They're not the ones driving a fucking no, truck and doing no. shit. And we have one guy at Moons, and that's me, right? I told him, I said, Jim, I said, uh, take, I don't want to put his name. I didn't give him his last name. Fuck. Him. But anyway, Fuck Jim, him. I said, I said, you know, you got one fucking guy booming. All right. That's me. One motherfucker. I said, you got to start telling. I don't give a fuck who wants first on the list. If we got a bunch of shit going out, you look at the route and you put that motherfucker in the route. So I'm doing, I'm not going from here. Right. An hour out to here to come an hour back to here to drive three hours back to here. No, fuckhead. You do it in a route. So we do a circle. Logic. Common sense, back. dude. Common sense. But I had to tell this motherfucker that. Like, you know, dude, I'm 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 telling you at my job, I have one guy who's who's an alcoholic. So you don't know which which version of him you're getting in each day. Some days he works like a motherfucker, some days he doesn't do shit. All right. But I've been getting in there and I'm like, the 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 boss kid, he he's like, he don't he's too passive. He don't want to yell at him. But I get in there and I'm like, Oh, I said, I, I got to go up to him. I'm like, I said, he didn't do all this shit. He didn't pull all these orders. He's supposed to go, he said, oh, I don't want to be sent home. Meanwhile, he fucking leaves first. First one to volunteer to leave early if we if we have an early leave, right? Mm-hmm. But I go, I said, listen, I said, you know what? I'm going to tell you something. I said, you see all these fucking orders that are on the board in there? I said, they're not going away. I said, they're being pushed. 
So I said, if you don't fucking pull them now, if you don't start getting on your ass and pulling this shit next week with all the rest of this shit, you're going to have to pull these and those. And guess what? I said, me and, my, and, me and Teddy ain't going to be here to fucking help you. I said, we're going to be out on the road. You're going to be doing that shit by yourself. I said, so fucking pull it now or you're going to be fucked next week. I'm the one that has to do all this shit, dude. Mm-hmm. I'm, I'm... Yeah. Yeah. Well, the only incompo- incompetent person I work with is my boss. Thank yeah. you. Thank God. At least the people I work with are, are good. They know what the fuck they're doing. Most of them know what the fuck they're doing and work. But the only incompetence I work with is my boss. So I get to deal with that next week. I'm really looking forward to it. it should be awesome. So, yeah. Uh, yeah you're going to fight. You, maybe you can work hand by hand in hand. Something. No, no, I'm gonna be coming on this show every week, get pissed off and miserable with the stupidity that's going on in my fucking job. Oh yeah, yeah. So I've been, I've been calm and now right because I've been off for three months, going back to work next uh, week. Oh yeah, yeah, miserable. yeah. You, you're gonna be all, be fucking, all even back, more but... miserable because now I got a taste of retired life and being home yeah. all the time. I'm gonna be extra fucking miserable at work. People are gonna well, come to me. I'm just gonna growl at them. <laughs> listen, we gotta play the lottery because listen, it's one point three. But I, I missed my chance to buy it tonight. But buy it. If it doesn't go off, if no one hits tonight, you got to buy it on Monday. One point three, one point three. You got to fucking buy it. If we do that, listen, you're going to be multimillionaire. If I win, right, you'll be a multimillionaire. Yeah, yeah. and uh, you know, back and forth, we'll have a studio, multiple, multiple yeah. high end studios. To the top, to the top. This is all we'll be doing. Top. This is it. This is it. This, this is it. is hundred percent. Fucking yeah. quit our jobs, and I'll fight. We'll get a big ass fucking studio, and I don't care if no one's listening. Canfield, you're going to be hired too. You're going to be hired to go around and promote. So okay. You threaten people. Listen to this fucking yeah. podcast. Kick the shit yeah. out of you. That's all you do. And Santos, you're going to go over and suck dick to get people to listen to us. <laughs> <Hey>. <laughs> We're going to hire everybody. All right. That's it. Y'all, y'all be set. Sean, be set. You guys all be set. Start stocking, up on, start stocking up on mouthwash shit. Uh, <laughs> Blue Collar Schmucks, number one podcast. Let's go. Let's do it. Let's make it happen, guys. <laughs> I'm going to shit all over Justin even extra hard. Did you call that money, Justin? <laughs> But I'd sell your ass, punk. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, shit. I'm gonna, I'm gonna pay. I'll pay Jackie to stop doing making all the money. But you know, she, she don't have to work for all that shit. I'll pay her, but she can't give it. My one, one thing will be she can't give Justin any money. Make him go back to work. <laughs> <laughs> I'll cover your salary, whatever you're making. But you can't give him a dime. Not one dime. Oh, no. All right. I'll double your salary. Double it. You don't have to work. <laughs> work. He's down with the kids, but just has to go back to work. He has to go back to work. <laughs> Shit. Yeah, no, he has to come work for me. No, 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 no. I'll make him work at White Castle. He has <laughs> to work at White Castle for this to work, okay? On the fryer. He has to be on the fryer. <laughs> frying fries all day, burning the shit out of his hand he all has fucking to come day. Smell like onions and shit. <laughs> all right. <laughs> Blisters on his hands and the fryer splattering up on his fucking hands all day. Oh yeah, yeah. especially because his hands are all soft and ridgy now. Right? <laughs> <laughs> uh, oh fuck, I love it. Oh, my favorite. He's my favorite one to bust. <laughs> he is. I don't know why. Even DJ, like I love busting the DJ's nuts or Nick's nuts, but no, Justin's my no, favorite. Justin, Justin is definitely on top. He's yeah, definitely on yeah. top. I don't know why. Poor kid. He really didn't do anything. He actually helped you actually help you his wife actually helps you get pregnant and now you just destroyed him. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's just short. <laughs> Thanks, Jackie. We do appreciate the help. We do. I don't make fun of Jackie. I just make fun of Justin. No, no I love Jackie. I love Justin too, but Justin's just fun. He's fun. <laughs> yeah, shit. Mike, let's wrap this one up. This was a good show. Another another good one. Uh little primer sometimes works a little bit in our favor so oh yeah yep every once in a while you just got to prime the engines you know what happens you gotta do it yeah so that's right but man that's that good. good shit can't be yeah. no fucking cheap ass shit no no but it, yeah dj comes to 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 uh nick's house on the on east and easter yeah and he's like hey man you, you want a shot i was like what you piss whiskey he's like no i brought good stuff this time what evan williams man i brought evan williams like that's not good whiskey, Deej. He goes, what? But it's like thirty dollars a bottle. Like, that doesn't make it good fucking whiskey. It's terrible. It's it's like cheap fucking Jack Daniels, and that Jack Daniels is garbage. Oh, Jack Daniels, fuck! I can't drink that shit. Even no, their good terrible. shit is it's, fucking it's garbage. Horrible. It's horrible. I had their I had their like their, their selector Jack Daniels shit. select. Yeah, it's no. fucking garbage, dude. 
You know, the it, cheapest uh, the cheapest whiskey I'll go is Jameson. It's Jameson, man. It's the cheapest. And I'll Jameson's buy. okay. Yeah, uh, that's you, why. You, like Jameson's is the last. That's the breaking point. You can't that's, go any lower than that's Jameson. the best cheapest whiskey you can buy. Yeah, it's like a. But you know, you want to go safe. You sit like Scotch, man. I, I, Johnny Walker Black. You're good. You're good. You can yeah. go. It's a decent. It's decent for the price. Fucking smooth. But yeah. uh, you got to spend yeah. a little money sometimes if you want a good a good alcohol. You can't. But and he he just does shots. But I would and no, I wouldn't do it. And that's why. No, I'm, dude, I like your shot on the ice. If I'm drinking that shit, I want it on ice. Yeah. Um, I'm not about shots. No, well, that's shots why he does like shots because when you're drinking shit whiskey, you want it to get over with as fast as possible. Yeah, yeah. He we got to get that boy changed up. He he got to. Yeah. Well, you gotta change him up. He's a cheap fuck, so it ain't gonna happen. Anytime, he is so. cheap. He is cheap. He makes me look like I spent. He do. He does. He does. <laughs> <laughs> you feel like you gotta wear a monocle when you go see. Are you going to Dina's house? I better put my monocle on. <laughs> hey, motherfucker! I brought Justin. some Johnny Walker. <laughs> I was fucking slap Justin in the back of the head. His monocle falls off. I pick it up, put it on, <laughs> take his hat. Top I'm hat. drinking Johnny Walker tonight. <laughs> 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 oh shit all right mike it was a good show tonight yeah it was fun. we will say good night to y'all out there and we will talk to you next week and of course canfield uh suck my balls good night everybody good night you are a schmuck